And yeah, hello, hello, hello. Welcome to Fluxtrot's hangar, where we store airplanes, helicopters, gliders, and all-terrain vehicles. <laughs> and let's see here. That's working. To stand by. What's that? Is, hey, guys. We are live. Hey. Can you hear me? Hey, I get five by five. Good evening, everyone. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to Flock Shots Hangar. I was just saying, telling everybody where we store planes, helicopters, uh, gliders, and all terrain vehicles. Oh, there, you're looking good down there, Flux. Hey, there he is. Keep, keep an eye on you. Yep. Right back at you. <laughs> two up, two down. Two up, two down, yes. <laughs> Oh, good stuff. <laughs> Dude, Dylan wants to know if we've made sure we fill out the paperwork to rent these uh, gooses. Uh, <laughs> oh, we well, did. That's, that's up to... <laughs> hey, uh, sign, sign your life away. Here we go. You got the extra insurance and the blinker fluid. <laughs> right? Yep, yep. Come on in to, to Western Dune ATV Rentals and uh, we'll hook you up, man. It's a bit of a long haul from Western Dune to uh, Colorado, but, uh, you know, it's only 19 cents a mile for, you know, for every mile beyond your contract. So, don't, you know, don't worry about it. It's okay. <laughs> Thanks for reminding me about the about the rental thing there, there, Dylan. I had fun creating that. <laughs> yeah, that's great. 
Oh, gosh. So, yeah, the other night, uh, uh, with us on voice is uh, Papa Mish. Hey, Mish. Howdy, howdy. Howdy. And uh, the other night, uh, off stream, we uh, were on... We were on the uh, the Discord channel, and uh, Papa Mish mentioned uh, this uh, Black Bear Path Road that uh, goes through these mountains up ahead of us, and we did not realize what we were in store for, at least I didn't, and exploring it in the Juice Goose, not racing. <laughs> I started out racing, though, I think. I was, draw I was drawing up on the map. Like, you know, lines on the map of where I wanted to go so I, I wouldn't forget as I was going through the valleys and the climbing and stuff. Um, and then and then Misha reminded me, uh, are we racing or 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 what? <laughs> Supposed to be exploring, I think. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So tonight, it's all about exploring. Yeah, we'll open it up a little bit, you know, on these things and, and, and see, you know, see what's going on and have some fun along the way. But, uh, man, we had such a great time exploring. It was beautiful. Oh, Stu got it, Dylan. Oh, congratulations, uh, STW. Nice. Oh, nice. Oh, man, congratulations to STW. That's great. Well That's played. awesome. Yep, well played. Well earned and well played, yeah. <laughs> yes. Nice, Dylan. Thanks for sharing that. That's awesome. Sleeper yes, Chris thank is checking you. in with the... Uh, the Hog Heaven emote and a number of other emotes. <laughs> Welcome in, Sleeper Chris. Good to see you. Hey, Sleeper. Good to be with you, bud. So. And yes, we are in Hog Heaven tonight. <laughs> if ever there was a Hog Heaven, this is it right here. Let's see here. Where is it? So this is what we're this is what we're uh, driving tonight. It's from Parallel Forty Two. Um, it's called the Juice Goose. I'm going to put a link to it in chat. If anybody doesn't have it and they want to want to grab it, it is fifteen bucks, but I have to say it's worth it. Um, Every penny. It's 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 a lot of fun. You've had fun with this thing, haven't you, Mish? Oh yeah, we we get in trouble, we get out of trouble, we go right back in. <laughs> yeah, we do. They've just done an amazing job for figuring out terrain spikes and. All that sort of thing. Although Misha's tracks, he does that for us. But but this thing is just amazing with uh, how they were able to get it to some sort of land vehicle that actually works in this environment. is is pretty amazing stuff. Right? So there's a link to Parallel 42's website, the Juice Goose. There's three variations, um, are like a rock crawler, a cruiser, and then a racer. Um, and yeah, it's a blast and you you'll see that tonight as we're exploring. Um, and the other thing I wanted to share is Charlie six. Let me move this out of the way. Let me share this screen. Let's see, I got to go here I'm gonna do that. And then I got to go to here. Okay. You guys should be seeing discord. And Charlie Six um, just posted this maybe 20 minutes ago. Uh, well, maybe it was 5.30 p.m. Pacific, about a half an hour ago. And uh, he has a channel on the hangar called Charlie Six's Hangar, where he can put stuff that he's working on. And he put up this note here that I want to share with everybody. He says, as I'm sure you are all aware, this past Saturday was Veterans Day. And we at VFX 41 would like to acknowledge and thank all of our veterans for the service they have given. And in honor of this day, we worked extremely hard on putting out our latest video. This was made by our student pilots and showcases some of the things that they have learned during their time flying the T-45s. We hope you all enjoy the video. Once again, thank you. And I thought, you know what? Let's, let's, let's play it. Let's, let's check it out on stream here. So, oh, awesome. Yeah, let I me, agree. Let me know if you guys hear it, the music.
Okay, I'm going to pause it there and ask Chad if they hear the music. Hope they do. Okay, they hear it. Good. All right, thanks, Skinflints. Let me restart it. And uh, here we go. VX41 Black Aces, if you're curious about what they're up to and uh, want to say hey to Charlie, uh, just, you know, jump in that Discord channel there and uh, and uh, and say hey to them. Um, uh, great job on the video, and uh, yeah, we salute to all our veterans here at Foxtrot's Hangar. And uh, what, a, yes, what a nice piece of work, man. Oh, that was that was terrific. And Doc Ahoy wants a link. Can we share a link to that? Yeah, let me see if I can find... Let me grab that here for a second. Stand by. Put that link in chat, you bet. And you are welcome. There you go. Nice. All right. So without any further ado, uh, let me uh, pull up... A little nav map here and let's see where is the right monitor there it is I'm gonna pull up a little nav, nav map and you can see that we're over here at Telluride and just to give you folks an idea um, we may need to to, to, to oh, what do you call it um, uh, slew we may slew uh, we'll see how it goes but we, we could follow this road out of Telluride Airport and come down here into the valley and drive through Telluride. And you, you can see where we picked it up last time was right in here. You can see our aircraft trail starting. And then we start up here and hit the hit the uh, Black Bear Pass Road uh, that goes through these mountains here. Um, only problem is, is there's a lot of trees um, kind of in this area. Um, 
So we may slew through those trees to get past them. Um, and kind of get up in here. But we can we can drive through at speed and get through Telluride and get over here. Then we'll decide what we're going to do with those trees. Okay? So I just want to give you guys an overview. So we'll head over Black Bear Pass Road. Come down here to... What was that, uh, Mish? I-40? Oh, um, Highway 550. Highway 550. We'll take that south down here as time allows and pick up is it Of Ofer? Uh, Ofire? Yeah. Ofer? O Ofir? Yeah. Ofir. Uh, trail. And come back. And it almost does a loop. You can see we were having some fun in here. And <laughs> head back up towards Telluride. Uh, and we'll see how far we get. See how, how, how far we get with the uh, time and everything. So that's the plan. And I'm only working with uh, two monitors tonight. So... I'm not able to switch back and forth real easy. Hey, Skin. Um, uh, thanks for checking in. Yeah, I'll, I'll try not to embarrass you tonight. I got your favorite color out here. Thanks. You want to get your screen share going, Tree? Oh, yeah. Let me do that. Let me see if I can get that going here. So nice to see that Chunky Flyer has decided to join us. Oh, hey, Chunky. Oh, good. In here. Hey, hey, Chunky. If this will work here, watch stream, make that big screen. Mm, I need to plug in that other monitor, I think. Oh, but that. This, nope, I can't do it. Uh, hmm. yeah, I don't think I yeah. can do it tonight. When he does that, starts talking while he's half holding his breath, and then you kind of, <laughs> don't you don't you kind of you just waiting uh. on the edge of the seat to hear the sound of somebody getting electrocuted? Yeah. <laughs> oh, <damn. laughs> Skin, I haven't died yet, <laughs> but I probably will. So just stay tuned. <laughs> we don't uh, we don't follow the standard rules of uh, of rip here uh, when we're yeah. Uh, although if you do fall off a cliff and you know, and it's a long ways down, it's it's kind of nice to say nah, I probably would not have survived <laughs> <laughs> on the first strike. <laughs> yeah. All right, you guys ready? Hit it. Let's go. Come on. Parking brake is off. The goose is warming up. There she goes. All right, we're out of here. Oh, you guys are gone. You started it. <laughs> the, uh... I'm running the 242 tonight just so I don't get uh, blamed blame for overpowering the trail. Although I don't I'm sure know it which one I up. picked. All right, so up here on the left, there should be some sort of road. Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> Whoops. Um, let's see where that road is here. You're talking about the highway yeah. out of the airport? Yeah, it's airport road. It's coming up here on the left. So if we just... Oh. Uh, like this thing right up here that goes vertical. Nice. What a way to start. Oh, it's not as smooth as it looked from far away. <laughs> you, you're correct. <laughs> okay. Not going up that way. Okay, so uh Oh I gotta go through this fence. Hopefully I can get through this fence here. Oh no the fence is uh it's a hard fence, guys. How do we get out of here? I like it. We might We're spend all, all evening at the airport. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody order food just in case. Yeah. Oh a bunch of wheels. Oh I'm already upside down. <laughs> If you oh, go on the right ridiculous. side of that hill, you can get uh, get out to the road. Okay, I'm past the oh, fence now. Oh man, I almost ends. make it. Almost made it. Okay, I'm gonna come uh, on. I'm gonna turn on my. Uh... Oh, where is it? I'm gonna inch turn by on my, inch, uh... come on. I'm almost at the top by the road. Cool. 
Ta-da! See you up there, Mish. Oh, I made it on the road. <laughs> that chunky flying by me? Yep. Ooh. Ooh, that terrain failure at 105 miles an hour was uh, interesting. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. Where are you guys? If you're out here by yourself, that means you went the wrong <laughs> way. <laughs> That's your first clue. First clue, yep. It, uh, it's important to recognize the warning signs. Yes. You think you're winning, but you're by yourself. You didn't win. <laughs> Great. <laughs> You're not winning. Here, here we are on Last Dollar Road, which is uh, kind of indicative of when you lose all your money at the casino, you take your last dollar, put a down payment on a ticket, head to the airport, and ask politely if they'll take you home. Right? Yeah. <laughs> to your home, not theirs. I mean, you know, let's let's get that clear. Am I getting this right? I hope I am. I don't see you guys. Well, are you yes, yes. sort of on the map? On the little map on the screen? Yeah, I'm looking I'm, at the map. I'm, I'm broadcasting you going? on little nav map my position. Wait, what's your direction you're headed? East. East. Of course. <laughs> what, what direction are you heading? I knew that. <laughs> uh, it, was, it was one of those other ones. <laughs> oh, my goodness. So, we, we have a rip award for dying. Do you have another award for just, like, yeah, idiot. Well, wrong a, way, a, Jose. I need a cut of lost. <laughs> I think it's uh, what we need is this free thinker award for the you know for free bla uh, blazing your own trail. Yeah. Yeah. I know, I know we're going east generally, but I believe that the shortest way to the place east is by going west. I'll go around <laughs> yeah. the globe. I'll yeah. pick up a an hour every exactly. time zone, so you know I'm practically going backwards in time. Yeah, that was my thought. <laughs> Nailed it. Nailed it. <laughs> so let's uh, let's hold up. Oh, is that is that tree passing me? Nope, nope, nope. Oh, I was gonna say let's hold up at when we get into the city. Let's group up in the city. Oh, oh I like how just calls it the city. That's chunky. Yeah, see, I'm yeah. in the orange. one. Oh, that was chunky. I'm in the teal one. Around. Okay, let me see where uh, Treetop is. I'm going to get up on the drone camera here. I should be close. <laughs> oh, my God, Tree. I, what? <laughs> I'm, I'm way, way. Uh Yeah, keep coming. <laughs> well, I was trying to go up the road, and you guys went around uh -huh. some what? cheater cheater way. <laughs> Well, we went like we, what we like to call the correct way. Oh, is that what that was? Oh, it's a, it, that's uh, it's such an exclusive term now. I, I, I get, get the feeling. Yeah. I get the feeling we shouldn't be using these terms. You know, <laughs> it's in, it's called inflammatory language. Ooh, there's a fancy house over here with a circle drive. I'm just going to pull I in. You're going to say, "Ooh, that was a fancy word." <laughs> yeah, it was a fancy word. No, I'm just going to pull in and ask for an ice cream cone since we're here. Oh, Skinflint is in the Juice Goose. Cool. Oh, nice. Yes, don't you worry. don't have to be crazy to join us, but it does help. It does so help. Come on in. You all kinds the only of way you stay sane of... is to be a little crazy. That's right. Let's see. Who, who else did we have last time? That was uh, oh Alec D. Yeah, Alec, if you're out there, come on, come on in. Don't Sorry. let the fact that we laughed at you the entire time last time uh, dissuade you from. I mean, we laughed with you, I believe, <laughs> not no. at you. But um, there's always uh, plenty of stuff to laugh at. Uh, I'm, I'm sorry, with. Yeah. Do you see our name tags up there, Tree? Yeah, I do. Okay, good. I, I apologize about all the treetop fans are back there at the airport. Hold me up. <laughs> I, like, God, I was trying all to get through them. All the, all the autographs like, you had to sign? Oh, my God. Oh, yeah. Finally That's... made it out of there. Whew. Gosh. What a, what a tough job. Oh, it is. 
Oh yeah, you're opening it up. I can't now. stay in one place too long. The guys in the white jackets will find me. <laughs> yeah. Hey, I got this hat made out of tinfo. You can wear it. <laughs> Keep going. Keep going. We'll catch up to those guys. Dang tree, you're on mm. it, man. Skin, skin's kind of back there a little ways too. Okay, we'll wait for him. No, I actually, that's what it was. I w waited for skin. That's yeah. yeah I know you going to join us. That doesn't fly, man, because you're here and he's still way back there. Oh, oh darn it. I got to think of something else. <laughs> How close are your skin flints? You want to you want to slew up here or you want to? You probably found it. Oh. Oh, we're getting, oh, we're getting buzzed by somebody. <laughs> Dude, that was. Uh, Mitch, looks like Mitch in the F-35. Here comes Skin. Nice. Yeah, he's coming. All right. I don't see his name tag. Is he down here with us now? There he is. Right. Okay, right. good, good, good. Okay, all right. All right, let's continue on. Tell me if I'm going too fast. You're Sorry. going too fast. No. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> just joke. <laughs> Boy, skin doesn't mess around, man. He's just like on it. Yeah, I'm looking forward to getting up on that trail again. That was amazing. Well, welcome to Tell You Ride, everybody. I'm a drive in formation with you. Hey, there's a charging <laughs> station. Maybe we ought to hit it real quick. <laughs> Was there five of us? This is great, man. Yeah. <laughs> oh, my God. See Who ya. was that? Okay, it's not necessary to commune with the squirrels. No. Squeak, squeaker, squeak, squeaking. <laughs> if, we, if we keep our tires on the ground, uh... Patrick Warburton was... What a, what a goofball. <laughs> okay, what's the road going to do here? The turning? Uh, I think we, we go can. straight. Looks like there's like a roundabout there with a tree in the middle of it. Yep. And I went right through it, just like they do in Germany. Here you go. I was telling Mies the other night when I was in Germany, they have roundabouts everywhere. Yeah. The yeah, major ones, too. the major uh, roads, you, you can kind of see them, but some of the little back roads that they have that they just put this traffic circle at, they almost always build a hill right in the mm -hmm. middle of it. Mm-hmm. And there are almost always uh, tracks going over the top of the hill as people <laughs> don't know those roundabouts are there and launch themselves off of it. Whoop, bridge. Ooh. Made it around it. Yeah, I did River. too. Yeah, in uh, Denmark, there's oh. one. Ooh, two get wheels. Back. Two wheels. Get back on the other wheels. No. <laughs> <laughs> huh. That could have been a little smoother. <laughs> you think? <laughs> <laughs> Woohoo! Oh I realize God. I don't get style points for that, but I think that the fact that I stayed on two wheels for about a block and a half has got to count for something. Oh yeah, that you definitely get style points for dying. I mean, but... <laughs> <laughs> ooh, 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 what's going on? What's going on? There it is. Ooh, ooh, this is kind of cool in here. Oh, okay. Got a little sideways, but didn't didn't flip over. Now, if anybody does research on this area, they will find out in in a quick hurry that Black Bear Pass is a one-way road, Whoa. and it's actually one way. 
in the other direction. So yes, we're going the wrong way on Black Bear Pass. Oh, okay. Oh. So just just to let someone know, in case somebody wants to try to bust our chops, it's uh, it's a known issue. But we're doing that because, well, when's the last time we followed any rule? <laughs> right. It was upside down. Oh, hey, I remember oh. this building. I was upside down for a minute. Oh. Is I'm this back road up right now? I see that. Is this road paved in real life? Um, I, uh, it's paved until the edge of town, I think, and then, you oh, know, eventually. And it's gravel. Yeah. Yeah, we just got on the gravel part, so. Enjoy that little water crossing there. Yeah. Get grouped up again here. I remember this building. Man, I got my, right my sandwich got soggy. Okay, let me uh, let me get a little damn map up where I can still see chat. Okay, and we are getting to the point. Okay, let me uh, let me show you guys where we're at here. Whoops. And we might just slew to the top of tree line because the trees are so thick in there that you can't see anything in the in the way that Sobo has modeled this area. Yep. So we're down here by this uh by this building. Hopefully this is coming across on the stream. And there's a whole bunch of switchbacks going on through here. And we tried taking them as you can see, but then you can see my path just starts cutting through because there were so many trees covering the road and stuff, we couldn't keep track of the road. And we found it easier to go ahead and kind of slew up a little ways and um, get out of the tree line. So that's what we're gonna do now. So let me uh, get back into here and let's go ahead and get in slew mode and figure out where we need to go. Uh, let's see, up a little bit. Oops. Oh, we're going to the top. Not, yeah, no, yeah, no, no, not to the top. Just, just above the tree line. But before you drop, d d stay in the air for just a minute, and then idiots like me can see where you are. Okay. There's all the switchbacks below me. And I'm, I'm a, I'm a little bit above tree level, but the angle of the hill is so great. Oh, I see where you are. So right there, Mish. Sure. Okay. You'll find yourself sliding down the hill, really. It's just, but this is probably some of the tightest switchbacks ever made for motor vehicles, which is evidenced by, um, the, the, <laughs> yeah, here I am. I'm just sliding oh, down the hill. Oh, man. Um, wait a minute, wait a minute, wait. Yeah, we stop, have to, stop, stop. We're going to we're, we're gonna have to get up, up a little higher here. Oh, come on, come yeah, on. Yeah, I'm afraid so. Yeah, that's not going to work. So, and the switchbacks at the ends of these switch, uh, or the uh, actual switchbacks on the end of this switchback thing section are so tight that you can't actually turn your vehicle. You have to go forward down one of these and then back down the next one and go forward on the, so you're going forward on the odd numbered ones and backing down the even numbered ones. And it's quite a trick. So it, it is one of the most unique sections of switchbacks in the world. Okay, let me see if we're on the trail here. Yeah, I'm going to have to. Okay, so. So, yep, this is on the trail. Just a smidge. In this water. Oh, man. Okay, I see where Chucky is. Don't move, Chucky. I'm going to come up to you. Well, no, I'm going to have to move up a little bit. I'm sliding back. back so. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just, just All right, a little I see bit, you guys. like a hundred feet or so, something like that. All right, I see you guys now. Okay, here I can sit nicely. Okay, so is everybody down on the ground yet, or is people still jogging? Uh, just about there. Ooh. It wants to end my flight. No. Nope. There is there is a, a bug in in the sim where if you're on an incline um, and you're just sitting there, your vehicle will slide on the incline. But if you put on your parking brake, it'll hold you. So if you're on an incline, you needed to stay still. Activate your parking brake, and then it'll hold you still. Yeah, 
the bug is that it actually slides you up, which is just really awkward. Yeah, see Skin Flints is up there. I'm up yeah. by Skin Flint. Okay, let's go yeah, find those guys. Break it breaks off. Yeah, he's up here in the meadow, which is I was just trying to stay out of the river, but looks I like I just want to get somewhere I can stop. <laughs> the rest Jeez. of the uh, rest of the trail is a little more uh, believable, yep. and we get a chance to do some yeah. scenic. Yep. Okay, we need to come down here, down towards the river. And just in front of the river is about a three foot wide path, and that's our road. And I've got my time. What time? What time do I have set? I got my time set for eight thirty four in the morning. And All the right. glass being the grass being backlit and like the shadows I'm seeing in front of me is pretty amazing. So just just wanted to share that. Eight thirty four, you said. Eight thirty four. Yep. Wow. Let me try I it. Sorry. Didn't even have to change mine. I'm at eight thirty three. So we uh, have had uh, we have the same theory here. Nice. Eight thirty three. All right. Looks like we're all grouping up on the road here. All right. Well, we'll see if we can kind of start crawling our way up the path. Hey, I don't think is tree with us. Yeah, he I, is right close to us. We're all right. Yeah. All right. Can to start head up the path then? We're we're in the middle of the darn trees here. Okay, where are you guys? Oh, I'm in front of you. And then the road's over there. Okay. And if you guys use little nav map, you'll be able to see it on little nav map, I think. Yep. At, least, at least my map that shows it. And hopefully we're all getting grouped up again. One, two, three, four, five. All right, so let's explore. We'll just keep oh, it's this not is fun. It's not a race. No. Yet. I'm going to cut across here just a little bit. Yeah. The terrain failure was right right through the curve. Yep. Now, this is about where, I don't know, uh, Flox and I were just sort of talking about the scenery and lollygagging around and going through here. And then I forget what it was. And. Uh, then he says, hey, did you realize that you're going slower than you've ever gone before? <laughs> <laughs> and I look down, I'm doing 12 miles an hour. Like, what? Yeah, look at this. I'm having fun at 12. <laughs> That's great. We are. And I'm thinking back to Mish and I exploring, uh, I don't know how long ago that was. Can't remember where we were, Utah somewhere. And oh, we yeah. Just... That's what we're doing. We were just trail riding. And it was That's what this will turn into once we get rid of some of these trees that are in the middle of the path. But Yeah, there's going to be some nice, nice scenic um, opportunities up ahead. Just keep following the total <laughs> out of it. Who did that? That didn't sound good. Who did Viper Strike? <laughs> I wonder if he likes oh. hearing me say, Viper Strike. <laughs> <laughs> Dang it, Bobby. Like a mischievous hey, kid. <laughs> We're just juice goosing around. I think I just got my goose juiced. Oh, man, look at that view. So cool. That must have been one of those uh, jump scares that we didn't hear. Yes. Yep. Yeah, because we're in Discord. Yep. yep. What have you been up to, Viper? <laughs> Give uh, Viper a shout out here. Okay, we're all grouped up again. Here we go. All right. All right, guys, let's go ahead and get this. Come on, Martel, don't make the same mistake I did. Oh, uh, look at that. Absolute mighty P28 era. I, I, I still... You know, and there's something to be said about not, not being the leader when we're doing this. 
because it kind of gives you more of a camaraderie kind of feeling that you're out here, you know, jeeping around <laughs> with friends, you know? It does. And Chucky and I can speak to not being the leader part two. And first uh -oh. Somebody's got really bright lights behind me. It might be me. Oh, look at this view, guys. Man, this is incredible. And then look this way. Oh, look this is at this amazing. View. Boy, in real life, you'd want a four-wheel drive up here, that's for sure. Look do, at that, Misha, man. Do people camp up here and stuff? Yeah. Yeah, there's little, there's little pullouts all over the place in real life. Wow. I can't imagine. You're up here. What are we? How many feet are we here? 12,119, according to mine. Wow. Oh, yeah, there it is right there. Wow. Gets stinking cold at night, by the way. Oh, I'll bet it does. Even, even on the 4th of July. You'd want heat up here, that's for sure. Thinking of some no, of those no. RV <clears throat> four-wheel four drive units, that's what you'd want. <laughs> cost a bazillion well, dollars. Yeah, well, but they wouldn't they wouldn't survive up here. I mean, even uh, you know, people that come up here with the with the jeeps that are almost jeeps, you know. Yeah. They they got jeeps. Uh, it says jeep, <laughs> but it's not really a jeep. Oh. You, you need you need a real off road prepared four wheel drive. Jeep. I thought you were talking about the Toyota, the FJ Cruisers. They call them fake Jeeps. Oh, well, a Land Rover would, would make it just fine. But So one of the other tricks is to uh, uh, have a button set up on your HOTAS or your steering wheel or whatever it is you're using that lets you do a third-person view and set it up to look behind you. Because oh, every yeah. now and then, you really need to look back there because we're still climbing at a... Uh, pretty impossible rate for a normal vehicle on two ruts. Whoops. Oh, there's a nice view down the valley down there. Yeah, there's an example yeah. of what uh, Misha's is talking about, looking behind. Look at the view wow. you're missing if you didn't take the time to look behind, right? Yeah, amazing. Okay. And try to stay on the trail, because wow. when you leave the trail, you could slide for... <laughs> couple of days oh my hey, gosh you don't, don't want to leave um don't, don't you have sky for sim what what about sky for sim don't you have it oh i do um i've got it up right now and there's one of the map overlays that you can switch to that actually has the highway marked oh has really the road marked yeah so you can stay on it pretty easily oh i'll have to i'll have to do that Oh, I, I thought am... we'd. Oh, good. Go. Cool. I thought we had lost everybody, but I just checked. Now we oh. got all five of us back here again. Oh, oh, Chunky, I'll have to. I don't have. I'm not going to do it now. I'll, I'll, I'll hook that up to uh, <laughs> Flow. I don't have Skype for Sim. I have it. I can get Skype for Sim if I'm in VR uh, with okay. Flow, but I don't. I I disabled the darn main menu of Flight Sim when I installed Flow. Ooh. Oh, okay. Did you so actually? I, you didn't shut off VR, did you? You're still in VR. No, I'm not. No, I'm in regular. I'm not oh, in VR. Okay. I want everybody to get as sick as I am. I mean, <laughs> no, I didn't. I mean, uh, yeah. <laughs> Eesh. Are you getting some uh, frame hits, Mish? Nope. Yeah, starting not, to get I'm a not, few. Yeah, no, I'm not getting any frame hits. <laughs> but you know what few. I am impressed with, guys? We're okay. We're in a flight simulator. We're on this Jeep trail, but I'll be darned if this Jeep trail is not cut in the side of this hill. We have yeah. such good terrain detail that the Jeep trail is cut in the side of this hill. <laughs> yeah. I mean, look at this. This is just... Look at that valley back behind us. That's just crazy. And to do this in real life... Oh, now see, there's this little little pull-off to the right makes me wonder why they would do that. Nice view to the right. Yeah, I suppose it's to get a nice view of that lake down there. I wouldn't look unless I'm stopped. 
<laughs> okay. There. I'm stopping. All right. Let me oh, see. Oh, that's just a gorgeous view. About. Everybody take a look to wow, the Wow. Right. Is that amazing? Wow. Chunky's looking for a higher, higher place to that, go. That's, nope. That's me. I'm right behind you. Oh. It's not me. I'm trying to find a place where my uh, juice goose is not sliding up the hill. <laughs> yeah, because it's uh, it's hard to hard to find a place where the parking lot or parking brake will oh, hold it. Uh oh, oh here, I'm going to pull off over here. I'm good. I'm good. Good spot to pull off. Yeah. Oh, I'll wait a minute, guys. Pick. Guys, okay, yeah, this is a good spot to pull off. I got to sh share something with you guys. I'm going to come over there with you. Oh, this is perfect timing. All right, parking, <laughs> parking brake is set. This, yeah. is, this is where we would pull off in real life. Take a look, you know. Oh, man. I'm going to get all of us in there. Hey, treetop, you got a parking brake? Uh, he's, hang on. Here, he's, I'm... he's sliding up the hill. You look, you can come over here. It's all. It's almost flat here. Just look here. Flasher six is in the group fly there screenshot area. Um, let me pull this up here. Uh, let's see. Share the screen there. Wait, it's really hard working with just two monitors. I tell you. <laughs> Discord and and Splasher Six says not screenshots because uh, he's in the group fly screenshot area, but not screenshots, but some in real life photos of the Telluride area back in 2005 when he was here. Oh my gosh! So nice. hopefully these are coming across on the stream. Yes. Mm -hmm. So there's that might be Telluride right there. It looks like from a cable car. There's a cable car uh, that Splasher was on. Dropping down into Telluride, it looks like. Looks just like the sim. Almost as good as the sim. <laughs> just, Almost yeah. as good. Yeah. There's another view. Wow, look at that. That's amazing. And we are, I think we're right up, up here somewhere. I think this is where all those switchbacks were. And then we, we started out up here. There's a... Flasher, they're at the top of the the tram up there. Wow. Room with a view. Wow. Isn't that pretty country? Amazing. Looking down at Telluride. There's some switchbacks going on down there. I'm still watching your, your ad. Oh, but okay. yes, there Hang we on. go. Yep, that's, that's the view from the... Uh... There's some of the ones yeah, that you missed like here. The and shopping then, area. And then well, I, said, I live here. I think we're up here. I think is where we're at right now. Up in this area here. Uh, No, because we... Wait, yeah, up there, yes. Yeah, kind of in there, plus, but a little bit more to the right. Oh, Just I that. see. You ride the ski lifts in the summer. Yeah, because the they oh, still have shops up there on the top of the hill that, that support the... Uh, the high altitude for the skiers and whatnot. Yeah, a little. little oh, wow. This That's is pretty crazy. Country. Wow. But I can tell you when you're on the ski lift getting ready to drop off the edge, it looks like the cables go straight down to the ground. Oh, man. Wow. So you, you to basically take the cable, the, the ski lift cable car system up over to the edge and then you watch the, the, uh, the car ahead of you just kind of looked like it falls. <laughs> wow. Wow. Not, not scary at all. No. Close, well, close your eyes. <laughs> oh, yeah, like you're really going to close it. Yeah. <laughs> the trouble is we keep our eyes open because we want to see it. Yep. If this is going to be my end, I want every frame. <laughs> yeah, true. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, anyway. Viper, uh, uh, by the way, Viper says he completed his around the world flight. Oh wow! Nice. Good for you. Good for you, Viper. That's awesome. 
completed That's his awesome. round road flight on Sunday and currently prepping for tomorrow's flight in Norway. Yeah. Yeah, so check yeah. out uh, Viper Strike, you guys. Always great content and uh, shares a lot of detail about the areas that he's flying over. And yeah, Paradox I'm... is checking in. Come drive with me. He says he got a note that Parallel 42 released a free racetrack. Ooh. Might have to try that out. I, I saw will, somebody. I'm going to say, somebody, but I didn't. It, it's not going to be better than Misha's, but we can try it. <laughs> uh, Splasher, thanks for the photos, man. He says the last three photos are from the uh, Black Bear Pass area. That's awesome. Wow. Yeah, thanks, Splasher. Well, all right, kids. It's time to hit, right, the let's, let's hit the trail. Hope Skin Flints is up there ahead of us. He's checking out the next uh, view. Boy, he's a doer. Um, he always has been. A All leader. Right, well, let, let's sign him up and just yeah. put him on the payroll. Yeah. There's a payroll? Am I missing something, yeah. guys? Yeah, yeah, I know. Everybody gets paid the same. <laughs> oh, yeah. and and just just because i know you guys know math really well if we all got a 30 percent raise it wouldn't hurt the bank at all <laughs> 30 and, uh, zero zero i think right it's still uh, zero yeah. yeah so we got it covered well, the check get, comes on the second tuesday of next week no we get paid weekly very, very weekly, weekly. No. <laughs> very weekly <laughs> there's a <laughs> It's it's the the go to answer if somebody you have a disgruntled employee. All right, thirty percent raise. Yeah. Wait a second. I volunteer. I know. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, somebody missed uh, that turn. I lost the road. Yeah, somebody missed <laughs> that turn. I saw that. Hey, yeah. Uh, road goes that way. Hey, buddy. There's a switch back over there, and uh, yeah. Hmm. Now where am I? Let's see. Uh, I see you guys. Just, you just need to come uh, down the hill yeah. a little bit to the left. Yeah, I, I can see you guys. Careful of those switchbacks now. And if need be, maybe, you know, take your doors off so oh, that you, yeah. can, uh, you, can, you can look that direction and see the... There we go. Uh, wow. Watch the road leave you. This is amazing. It yeah. is. This is uh, crazy fun. <laughs> I want to give a shout out to... Good day, Mike. Good day, Raleigh. Hi. Oh, good day, mate. Raleigh, got to come join us in these things. And we just got raided by Comic Crazy. Welcome in, Comic Crazy and Raiders. Oh, my God. Planet Neutral's there. Comic Crazy <laughs> blowing it up with emotes. Welcome in, Planet Neutral. Nice. Nice. Hello, kids. Guys. We're, so we're juice goosing the uh, Black Bear Path Road, and the detail, the terrain detail in the sim is so good. We've got the road cut out here in the sim. Look at this. This is crazy. And look, and always got to take a look behind. And look where you've been, man. This is amazing. This is just I can't a believe blast. the detail. And this, I mean, it's a sim. It's a flight sim. It's not a jeeping sim. <laughs> Yeah, it's, it's not a Jeep trail. No, and I, in fact, I was telling well, no, Fox, I'm, I'm researching, you know, new areas, oops, to to uh, explore with the, with the aircraft. But it's like, wait a minute, that, that area might be good with the gooses. <laughs> yeah, it, it's really going to be hard to tell, I think. Just, um, you're going to have a few crossover locations. But it's just so much... So much fun to see this. Oh man, I'm 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 just impressed. I just like wow. Yeah. Well, just I'm like uh, I was telling Chunky, I I I've been uh, exploring Midtown Manhattan and realizing how much fun it is to go blitzing down a street, then dive into an alleyway somewhere, and and realizing that nobody can see you in there because. The buildings all the way around you will hide your name tag. <laughs> <laughs> hide and seek. Yep, we can play a little hide and seek. Oh, it's kind of cool. You know, this road is pretty rough. We don't need these uh, terrain failures to, to help us at all. <laughs> no, isn't that true? And uh, it kind of makes me want to, uh, you know, actually uh, fix this road. I don't know what it'll take or if it's even possible in the SDK, but... 
we could make it just just a hair smoother, just about fifty percent smoother, or make it like two ruts in a in a in a field or something. Except that it's almost all rock up here, so you're not going to have any grass down the middle of a two rut road. Rut road. <laughs> yeah. All right, rut road, raggy. <laughs> yeah, I just realized. Uh, yeah, that's not. Oh, that's a nice view off of here. Let's see, uh, Common yeah. Crazy Juice Goose, where we go, the U Hills Come on. outside and east of Red Bluff is a blast. And there you go, Treetop. Oh, nice. man. Let's see. Uh, well, go ahead. Uh, I was just going to say, Mish, close to where you live, the Great Sand Lake Park or something like that. Oh, like, Sand Dunes? Uh, what is it? Here, I had it pulled up because one of the places I hit when I was looking around, uh, Great Dunes National Park. Um, okay. We went there once in the aircraft and we used the airport. Well, I don't remember. I remember going over those dunes, but Fox, you remember that? It was right next to, uh... A range, a mountain range of yeah, some sort. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember those dunes. Yeah, yeah. near Mount Bonka. Yeah, I've that been would be in real life. That would be fun too. So just keep hmm. that in mind. Yeah, those dunes yeah. were were a blast. They'd be fun in this thing. We did those in the Ooh. in the in the Wombi buggy. Um, That's right. what we did. Are we sticking to the road or what? So where I'm at right now, we we got to do a dog leg. Um, a little bit south, and then the then yep. we'll pick up the road again. Yeah, that's um, what it's, uh, I was. I didn't know if we wanted to try and get to the top of the hill or if we're just gonna stick to the road. Uh, we'll 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 stick to the road and head on down. Okay. Um, All right. Let's see. Let me catch up with chat, guys. Uh, GI Joseph checking in says, "Good evening, so fun." Oh yeah, you got that right, bud. You got that right. Oh. Uh, let's see. Comic Crazy says Edson is making a road between all of his scenery packs. He's a he's very excited for that one. Oh, oh wow! Like, yeah, nice. that's a great idea, right? You have all these scenery packs, and he's putting roads in between them because he got stuff like this now. That's amazing. And if I missed anybody in chat, my apologies. Uh, I hit the hit the uh, follow button there and take a joyride in one eight Romeo in the top left corner of the stream. If you do that, and I'm gonna start following down this road here. Oh wait, first I gotta take a look around. Take a look over this way, and then. Kind of back where we were. He, That's you need to get closer to the edge on that one to really enjoy that view. <laughs> oh no, you're close enough. There you go. Yeah. Oh, sorry, my mic wasn't down, but comma crazy. I'll check that out by Red Bluff there, outside of East Hills. Yeah. All right, heading down this Ooh, way. East Hills. That's not Red Bluff, Colorado. Then it's a different Red Bluff. Uh, probably California. I'm guessing. Yeah. Okay, where'd you guys go? You tried to ditch me again. <laughs> <laughs> We're headed south. Just just don't go more than about 15 seconds in one direction before you check for yeah. other other drivers. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> I, was, I was rolling down at about well, five miles an hour, so. Well, what we've always said with this group is safety first. We, oh, yeah. <laughs> safety <laughs> third? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> You, you're, you're misunderstanding something. <laughs> Skinflint's huh. making his way over. I don't think the words safety and first have ever come out of my mouth in the same sentence. <laughs> <laughs> Unless it was that one incredulous day where you said, safety can't be first. Maybe, yeah. If there was a word in between there, like, no, not. Or <laughs> All right, I think we're grouped up again. I don't know. One, two, three, four. Where's is Skinflint's there? Is he up um, oh yeah, just there behind Chunky. There you go. Yeah, somebody's go. hiding back yeah, there. Somebody was in front of me. I didn't see them. All right. All right. There up. we go. Here we go. Carry on, boys. I'm gonna get in the back so I get to watch all of you go sliding off some edge somewhere. You know, just I can hope. <laughs> And now we got some nice scenery in front of us here. Wow, look at this. I got to work on the sensitivity of my steering. 
I got the throttle working really good on the controller now. Oh, don't worry, Chunky. I know that you're very sensitive. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> yes. Wait. Oh, wait a minute. No, I'm sorry. Uh, different person. I, yeah. <laughs> I had him confused with somebody else. 20 years in the military, my skin is pretty thick. <laughs> <laughs> this, this Xbox controller thing, I can't say. That's what I'm using. Things. Yeah, it's this is great. Yeah. You mentioned it last time, and it's like, you know what? Let me go give it a try, because I was actually steering with a joystick, and it's like, yeah, this just isn't good. No, it wasn't. So I, uh, huh? I, I gave it a try, but the throttle was really just, I don't know, I didn't like it. And um, I finally got some, adjusted the sensitivity of it, and I got a curve that really lets me just go as slow as I want or as fast as I want. Oh, perfect. Yeah, that's that's so nice. Yeah, I, I like this I'm thing. Just, I'm trying to get it with the steering now, too. The steering is still a little... A little too much. Well, I'm. But that's the beauty. Don't... You can con you change it to what you like. Yeah. And, yep. Yep. I am just f full tilt immersion here with VR and a steering wheel and. Yep. Uh, <laughs> and it's just. I would hang my arm out the window, except they took the doors <laughs> off. So. That that feels more normal as I try to hang my, my arm out the window and I realize that there's nothing there. Then I look and see that I've already taken the doors off. And that just reinforces the uh, the immersion part. Uh, my only problem with that is I have my dog with me, so he may jump out. <laughs> yeah. Oh, true. He's still, if he's with you at this point, he'll, he'll always be with you. Yeah, he'll stay with yeah, you. Yeah, true. If I haven't chased him away <laughs> now. Yeah. He hasn't given up on me yet. <laughs> you know, when you keep them in the dark, though, they just don't know what they're missing, so it, it works better that way. Yeah. <laughs> hey, come on, you guys. Come on. This is fun. I love looking ahead and seeing the road up ahead of us. Yeah, that is yeah. fun. Um, and it looks like it's down there to the right over here, too. Yep. Anything more than about uh, 50 yards away is going to look fairly realistic here. Right. Even the road up ahead of us that's about, you know, 150, 200 yards up, it's, that's what it really looks like when you're on the trail. Wow. We need to get on that the, the road over there on the right side. I think we're going to end up over there. Are we? I think so. And if I'm going too slow, you guys, you know... No, it's just oh, about no. right. It's just about right, right? And take it all in. Yep. And I'm trying to switch to external view and see you guys from time to time without driving off the path. <laughs> awesome. Oh, no, go I ahead. Wish... Drive off the path. Who cares? Mish, you had mentioned it before, and I kind of agree with you. I wish they would um, have an option to make it where the Jeep, you know, the, the vehicle stayed smooth and the everything around you bounced because this is a little ridiculous in some of this. It really oh, is. VR, right? Yeah. Well, uh, all of the titles, all real racing titles that have, you know, kind of matured, have got a um, a setting to lock your camera to the horizon so it doesn't do this vertical bouncing thing all the time. Oh. And even in a standard racing sim where you're not, there's no bouncing at all, but you do have elevation changes. <laughs> you, you know, your your neck becomes a shock absorber in a, in a real vehicle and so they they would just need to add that just yeah i agree normally it doesn't bother me but a, this was this is such a rough road that i i'm definitely noticing oh, yeah. it now. well yeah. and if you need a short break from that then go into third person view and look behind your vehicle so, and that's just oh a yeah little, it's a little smoother yeah. that way but i'm not getting sick i just it's just yeah. aggravating just tiring <laughs> Yeah. You realize you can't do this all day long. Look at this. If this was a fort in, fort in real life, I mean, come on. <laughs> Coming down this little yeah. hill right here. This this is this is real. So at, at any point, now I don't know what this would cost, and apparently I'm going to have to go look now because this, you know, if you guys ever converged on Colorado, I'd take you on this trail. Oh, that'd be awesome. It, uh, that'd be a memory for a lifetime, man. 
it would it'd probably be the dumbest thing we ever did together, too. Like, you know. Now we'll oh. see some stuff. Before I agree to anything, who's driving? <laughs> <laughs> I knew that was coming. That's a great question. Uh, <laughs> uh, the person stupid enough to rent the Jeep without a uh, without an insurance policy. Yeah. <laughs> No, I'd, I'd rather just rent the driver. <laughs> friendly Ron's rentals, you know, that's... Uh, <laughs> yeah. do they have I've already seen Jeep? you guys rent. Do they have yeah. pink Jeep tours out here? <laughs> oh, dear. Yeah, they did get some... Uh, in Garden of the Gods, just west of Colorado Springs, I think they've got oh, some... pardon me. Excuse me. Pink Jeeps. Pardon me. Yep, that's a nice attempt at a pass, but gravity had other plans. Well, this little valley isn't exactly subtle either. Look at this beauty. Right? Yeah, this is just gorgeous back up in here. I know, and last time we were in the Gooses, and I think I mentioned I was having a hard time steering and turning. Mm -hmm. Sure. Well, I figured out what it was. My, um,. Uh, my joystick was uh, turned on for it. so the joystick was giving a uh, uh, an input. Uh huh. It, it was, was fighting. It was fighting my uh, my yoke. Yeah. I got that turned off and a lot happier tonight. tonight. Oh, Flocks, we're going past that guy's place where where you went up and checked out his uh, tailing pile. Oh, let's go. So if you guys look over your right shoulder, you'll see a little house. And uh, some gold mines up on the side of the mountain behind him. Yeah, so could you imagine being, you know, living out here away from everybody, and then all of a sudden you get, you know, five or six ATVs coming in? <laughs> and you, I you have know. my shotgun out. Yeah, I have the shotgun. Oh, and, so you, and, oh, the, so you know. And we're just, we, we're, we'd were we have to pretend we're so oblivious to the fact that we've just disrupted his entire life. Yeah. Hey, are you mining for gold or something up there? Yeah, oh, oh, you didn't, you don't have any? You mind if we check? <laughs> All right. <laughs> any spare gold laying around? Can I borrow a couple yeah. of gold? <laughs> we're, you know, we're from out of town. Yeah. I've, never, tree, I've never seen tree gold top before. pretty good. <laughs> yeah. Treetop's pretty good at finding gold in weird places, so let's yeah. let him have a look. Yeah. Get in there with a hammer and a chisel, my friend, and just start tapping around on things. Yeah, you mind if we stay a couple of days? Oh, <laughs> we're in. So, so here's here's the house, and I'm you know I'm sure there's there's a structure here, and I love the little water crossing we had to go over, uh, to get to get over here. There's a little bit of a river yeah. crossing there, but keeps then, the fake jeeps out. And if you go right. kind of chunky flyer is, yeah. Especially in that drone camera view here, you can really see the tailing pile, the mine that's being dug inside the side of the mountain there. And yeah, skin flint or a chunky fire is up there. So we'll head up there and check check that out, and then we'll get back on the trail. And he built a road up this far. Apparently, that's to you know start hauling back all that loot. Go check out that cross country action here. Yeah, here's his first little tailing pile. This one probably just didn't uh, just didn't produce enough to get lunch at McDonald's. So that had to have been. A... Oh man! Yeah, there's a couple of ditches up here and stuff that are a little tough. Yeah. Here we go. Ooh, wow. <laughs> nice. So yeah, right in the side of this mountain, there's a, I don't know if it's silver or gold or, or what he's hunting. Yeah, we don't know, but. Let me uh, take another shot here. Oh, that's a cool shot right there. Um, that is, I don't care who you are. That's a cool shot. Yeah. Hang on a second. Let's set my parking brake. There we go. I'll see if there's a uh, Google Street View for up here, but I'm pretty sure there isn't. 
<laughs> Probably not. <laughs> Probably not, right? <laughs> Can you imagine the Google car going up here going, oh, just one more road, and I can call it quits for the night. Hey, hey Tree, I, I don't mind sharing the road with you, but not the same spot, man. Uh, sorry, sorry, I'm trying. <laughs> sorry. <laughs> nice job, Skin. Look, <laughs> he, he he went for the. Well, I'm sure it looked like a uh, like the uh, uh, transmitter. What is that? That long jump thing. Yeah. Just rolled it down this right. And uh, guys, while we're parked here, I'm gonna give a quick shout out oh. to Burstix, uh TV. He's checking in oh, uh, in chat there. So, say, <laughs> Floxy, Floxy, welcome in, Burstix. Good to see hey, you. Hey, Burstix. Good blitz. That is so great that you're flying. Grab your juice goose hey, and come join us. So awesome. Yeah, come we join got, us. Uh, we got we got oh, another great landing, great landing. Now remember, guys, lots more cool road today. to go see. Oh, it looks like we have. And an you'll think, man, I've never had that much fun going 15 <laughs> miles an hour. That's the slowest we've ever gone in flight sim. <laughs> I think so. <laughs> and we're having a good time. Yeah. Oh, bear. Well, geez. <laughs> you got it. <laughs> we all missed it. Okay. And the winner is. All right. Yeah, welcome in, Burstix. Welcome back Paradox. on the trail. Says according to Google, there is Addy S Cabin near you. Addy S Cabin is near us. Addy S, yep, yep. We're uh, the the uh, cabin's just right around the bend here, and I'm not saying that using the slang of what "round the bend" means. All right, we're getting back on the highway yep, here. Yep, get, uh, highway. Back, back <laughs> nice, the road. dirt road. As <laughs> soon as you do faster than fifteen miles an hour, you're gonna feel like you're speeding. I think yeah. this is this is where we should be right here, right? Yeah, we got to go back across that little river here to the left. Oh yeah, yeah, yep, yep. Am I going the wrong way? Let's. See. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> we should be heading north right now. Yeah. <laughs> You're heading north? Yeah, we got to go did back you, to the road. Oh, there we go. Did you got sample you. that? Flocks, did you sample that so you can play it yeah. later? <laughs> Am I, I going the wrong way? <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> what was it? Uh, Gilligan's Island, wrong way, Corrigan. <laughs> I remember that. There's that little oh, water crossing. Man. That's the other thing. That's Gilligan's Island taught you what what friends will do because oh, that was great. Gilligan, Gilligan only asked stupid questions for eight years straight. Yeah, and it was great. Still, his buddies just stuck stead by him. Like, nope, no, nope. it goes like this, Gilligan. You take the take the fork and stab your food, and then put that part. No, no, the other part with the food on it. Put that part in your mouth. <laughs> yep. Yeah, I, yeah, we all watched that. So this kind of forked off. I guess this is the main trail. There looks like there's another one to the but left. Speaking of that, oh, sorry to interrupt. No, but, okay. Uh, we should think of uh, taking these things to fauna, where the wildlife is. Wouldn't that be fun with the giraffes and yeah, hippos oh, yeah. And all that stuff? We okay, should... I can build an outdoor zoo for you, just to, so we could do this all in one trip. <laughs> I've been thinking about getting that that pack with the animals uh, that's in Africa. Yeah, I did. I bought it. I just did you. I, I did, but I then I went to Fauna and I didn't find it. So I have them. I just haven't seen ah. them yet. No, there's a there's an actual like area that they did where they put all the animals and everything in. Right. I think it's called in, Fauna. F A U N A. Yeah. No, this is like a park. It's like a like a national park or whatever type thing. And you bought it off Marketplace? or you're, I, that's I haven't you bought it. I haven't bought it, but I've seen like uh, Four to Learn to Fly and stuff like that. Yeah. They've done so some kind of flights in there. Or preserve or something. Yeah, like yeah. That. Well, that's what I bought. It was 15 bucks. So I just haven't uh, gone there yet. So, um, But it, okay. in, a, in a goose, it'd be a blast. Yeah, you can drive right up to the animals, let them walk right through you. Right. <laughs> I, I, I had, uh, with the airplane, 
I got in front of uh, some bears and they stopped and the other bears kept going, but the bears that was in their path, it, they stopped until I moved huh. out of their way. Nice. All right, here we go. We got a nice little uh So that's where all here. the That's where all the computer power is going, right? The silliness. Come on, this turn, guys. Come on. Oh, okay, oh, I'm going to wow, look at that. It's just a, a little, cool little turn. A little shortcut. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me, pardon me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just creeping. All right. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Caught an edge. Yeah, I want to take the this thing over to see the animals. That that that'd be a blast. All right. So Tree wants to go to the zoo. Who else wants to go to the zoo? Yep. <laughs> Well, Would you like popcorn and cotton candy while we're there? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, well, <laughs> well, there we go. Would. Yeah, perfect. No, well, if you're a good boy, then we'll go. Uh, <laughs> next. Well, it if has really to be. Good, we'll get you a balloon. It has to be the movie theater popcorn. You know, that's the stuff that really that's tastes stuff? good. Yeah. Oh. Kayak Kevin checking in, tree. Hey, kayak. Nice to see you, bud. We're about to come up on the highway here. Yep. And then we can go almost straight across, grab County Road 14, and continue on the journey. Unless okay. people need a break. I'm going to grab a refreshment when we hit the highway. I'm going to grab a refreshment. Yeah, me too. I'll take a quick break. Okay. I'll refresh my refreshment. It's getting pretty low. I hope I have a refreshment in there. Well, don't these things have coolers in them or something? I got a couple um, of them. Maybe. Yep. I haven't tried using that one yet, thankfully. Yeehaw! Get this okay. bucking bronco to get. Yeah, here comes the main the main road here. Now this is not going to look like a road for me because I've got the the uh oh what is it called uh uh you know the the seasons oh uh, what is that called. Uh, hmm. Accusim. 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 Yeah, and, Accusim. Oh. and they put down a terrain uh, thing now on the ground so that the terrain, the ground will match the season. And it actually overlays like the pavement. Um, so it looks like I'm kind of on a grassy road right now. I'm not Weird. Sure this, yeah. So that's part. So that's, so we're on a main well, road right now. We, we only go, we only go like 10 yards and then we take a left and we go up on the yeah. other side and we hit County Road 14 and, That'll take us to the uh, Ophir Pass, uh, start of the Ophir Pass Road. So, okay, let me uh, see if I got a refreshment in here for me. All right, uh, I do. I think it's probably appropriate to take a three. Yep, I'll put up the intermission sign, and we'll come back in about three to five minutes. Here we go. <laughs> Somebody's on the horn. Great.
Hey, Sleeper Chris. It's going good. Yeah. Going great. Glad you joined in. We're in hog heaven here tonight. Hog heaven. Can he hear you with the intermission up? I think so. Yeah. Just curious. All right, so I can see what I'm going to have to do here now is uh, I'm going to have to make some liveries for this thing that actually has our names on it somewhere so we can see who is who. <laughs> oh, that'll be. <laughs> I'll, 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 you know how the license plate just says goose? I'll fix it to, to be something, oh, you know. Oh, that'll be great. <laughs> Three flocks, chunky, miche, you know, something like that. <laughs> Oh, that'd be awesome. And and to your point, you think about it, how many things have we purchased and we use them a couple of times and it's just like our whole life with software. Some yeah. stuff, occasionally you get something you stick with. It's like, oh yeah, this has value. This is one of them. It's like, wow. Yeah. I, I honestly expected this to have kind of a, you know, 15 minutes of fame and it'll disappear, but it's too good. Yeah, it really is. And it allows us to see stuff that we wouldn't see. If we're flying over the top of things, you know, at 200 knots. This Something is, else that just really kind of caught me by surprise is as we're, as we're taking these trails, I was thinking about the, the poor folks that would have, have blazed these trails in the beginning because they were probably... So you have to make sure that you're building your road without too much of a grade on it. And and that was just the only way to get across the mountains, you know. And now here we are. We don't even walk the path. We, from the, from the comfort of our homes, we're simulating <laughs> going, going over this trail yep. in, in a motor vehicle. And um, it's like we aren't even putting any effort into it. So... <laughs> Yeah, oh, this is great. And we're seeing what they would see. Yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> um, Skin flips. Me, me. All right. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Kai Kevin says, uh, rest in peace to those poor souls. <laughs> yeah, true. So, okay, so let me look at little nav map here. Let me pull that up. <laughs> and you say that we turn to the left and pick up. 40 or is it also known as 550 us 550 if you look at my okay I am not seeing that 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 highway that you're talking about. All I see is 550. So, yeah. So I'm okay. So I'm gonna follow you. You're gonna you're. Uh, I'm in. Don't leave yet. <laughs> you were on it. You were on it. That's it. Right here where we're headed. Okay. I think skin flints is going up it. And right. I am ready. Let's go. I was going to say, I'm not sure what Skin Flint is doing other than trying to catch air. Uh, he was catching a lot of air. Yeah, he was. <laughs> and uh, and then when he blew his horn as he went past, I went, oh, good. They modeled the Doppler effect. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shoot. I just spun out. Oh, here, I'm going to drop down. I'm going to go to the lower trail here. Oh. Ooh. It, it comes back to this anyway after a hairpin, so. Oh, yeah, Skinflitz is like, move it or lose it. Me, me. <laughs> <laughs> Road hog. He, he's like the roadrunner. Me, me. Okay, well, I'm going to go kind of slow up here, Chunky, because we're I'm waiting on. Yeah, you're good, man. If the group has followed. I'm looking for you. Where are you? One, two, three, four, five. Uh, go, turn left, or sorry, turn right, both of you. Flocks and skin flints. Oh, yeah. 
And you see our names over here? Yep, yep. Oh man, I'm just spinning left and right. Here we go. Is your emergency brake uh, cycle your emergency brake? I find that. No, I'm sorry, your parking brake. Sometimes that. Uh, yeah. Takes that away. Yep. Thank you. Beep beep. I can hear him from here. Oops. Got a little crazy there. Oh, <laughs> uh, just keep keep coming this direction. You're you're uh, half a mile back. Wait a minute. No, you're going the wrong way, sir. Where where the heck are you? Right. <laughs> That's okay. You're on the right road now. Yeah, I am. Yep. Okay. So instead of instead of being <laughs> on, I mean, it's still going to be a gravel road, and there's still going to be a tree or or two blocking this gravel road. But this is uh, this is an actual county maintained county road. They need to come out and uh, put the grader on this thing. Do yeah. you think so? Uh, yeah. Well, that's for sure. Our tax but, dollars work for us. <laughs> <laughs> well, this is my tax dollars, so yeah. Oh, yeah. You know. Oh, that's right. Oh, yeah. In real life. Yeah, I guess but, I can't uh, complain then. Yeah. I'm an out-of-state user. Uh-huh. Yeah, I'm supposed to be a little more appreciative, I think. Uh, I think so. Stop off at every little tourist trap, buy something, whether you need it or not. Yeah. In that case, it is our tax dollars. Yeah, yeah so then, <laughs> then you're helping. Then you're helping. I think but we how about this? Uh, don't don't forget your look back, because we, we're climbing up out of this canyon, and because of the massive horsepower of these four-wheelers, you don't realize just how much uh, how much grade we're climbing. I think we all need air fresheners. <laughs> all right, so now <laughs> I think I think we're in the best air freshener there is right now. <laughs> Open cockpit in the Colorado <laughs> Mountains. Okay, yeah. sharp sharp right hand turn. Oh, I think uh, skin flints went the other way. You went too far, skin. I think. Yeah, I he's know. he's practically at the top of the hill. This is uh, called St. Paul's Lodge up here on the right. Wow. We're going almost straight south there, Skin Flints. Uh, Splasher says, uh, got to sign off. Have a north. great night, guys. Oh, yeah, All right, Splasher, we'll see you, bud. Thanks for popping in. Late, thanks, for sharing those thanks for sharing those pictures, too. That was awesome. What was the name of this thanks. lodge? Thanks, Splasher. St. Paul's. St. Paul's Lodge? Yep. All right, Skin Flints is catching up. Me, me. <laughs> Love it. Okay, just like just like a kid at Christmas. Eventually, you got to take that toy away. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> May I have another? <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's what I like to call a fatality, Mitch. When you let me know something bothers failure. you. <laughs> When you let me know something bothers you, I'm just going to, you know, yeah. <laughs> poke that bear. <laughs> so Im imagine what this road looks like in real life. Here's the switchback. Oh, my God. Seriously tight switchback right next to a... Um, Rain spike. Well, yeah. And, and to, uh, to have a drop-off right there where if you make a mistake, it's just up, oh, it's down. Mm -hmm. I'd be, be like Alec the bike. other day. I'm still falling. Yep, still falling. Yeah. <laughs> For a long time. <laughs> yeah. And people are talking about other things, and then you hear this voice from the distance. This is Alec. I'm still falling. <laughs> yeah, I'm still falling. He said he wants to know. Checking in. <laughs> yeah, I'm still falling. Gravity's still having its way with me, and yep, still falling. Yeah, it was a, that was so much fun. I wish they had like a uh, a meter on this thing or something that you could see the the grade, you know, like your angle. Oh yeah, you can see the sideways angle. You just can't see the. Yeah. Somebody needs to make a mod, put an artificial horizon on here somewhere. <laughs> yep, and then lock the camera to it, and then we can travel all these rough roads without fixing them first.
See, the, the uh -oh. trees are pretty tight in here, but you can still see where you're going. So that's yep. good. There we go. Oh, man. It's amazing how they are able to pick up the grades here. I mean, I get tired just sitting here going up <laughs> these things. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I think what it would take in real life to walk this. Oh, dear. It's like incredible. We're seeing yep. stuff that we just wouldn't see. Pulling on the reins of a of a very tired mule who just about had enough of you. Yeah, exactly. And the reason why the cart's so hard to pull is because it's loaded with gold, and that stuff weighs, you know, like... I, yep. My butt's sore just thinking about riding a mule up this. Oh, my gosh, <laughs> yeah. Let's see. I lost the road here, but I can see where you guys are. Oh, there it is. And do you notice how much uh, wider this road is and smoother, kind of, than, than uh, <laughs> Black Bear Pass? And this is this is just a, a wider road. So this is the difference between a county road and a the only way across the pass road. And this little angle right here is supposed to unload your gold just down into that ravine. So that's where I'd put my house, down there. Yeah, yeah. And, until you get the occasional Jeep coming through your front yard. <laughs> Oops. I just wanted to see what was on TV. Sorry. Guys, I can't. I still can't believe we're running a flight sim doing this. I mean. I know. It's <laughs> amazing. Oh, man, the, view, the view to the right is awesome here. We yep. would never have thought of this. Well, and this is uh, this is probably worth making a stop up here at the top, because Oops. when you look across the valley, you can see Black Bear Pass Road, cool. quite a few miles of it. Let's see, am I pretty? Yeah, this is this is our this is our official pullout, where we okay. take a look down the pass and across the valley, and you see all the little oh, yeah. white lines, and that's Black Bear Pass Road. That's where we came down, huh? Yep. It's the only only way to get your gold to market. And if you want a cheeseburger, you take the same road. <laughs> wow. Oh, my gosh. Look at that view. Oops. Yeah. Zoom okay, well, there. we're out of Timberline now, so the going will get a little bit more scenic. Wow. There's, there, okay, there's the road. There's that's the, that's the Black Bear Path Road. Right there, there <laughs> we go. Oh, that's a good shot. Man, that's a good parking shot. brake. Okay, somebody else is there. not in my picture. You want to pull up alongside? Uh, I think Skinflints or let's see where they're. Uh, let's see. Who is that? I think it's Skinflints. No, oh, oh no, me sure above us. Yep. I'm I'm about a hundred yards away. I'll come back down for a picture. Okay. Yeah, as long there. as I don't get too big ahead of steam, and then I can't stop. Wow, what a picture! There we go. Oh, are you? Okay, parking right, brake set. Picture. Permagrin yeah. on. Permagrin. <laughs> Got it. All right, take a sip. That's right. Got a little sip. Uh. <laughs> exactly. That's what I was thinking. All right. That's Somebody new can lead. Because it's not hard to follow now. You just sort of follow the road, and I'll try to alert you if there's an intersection, but I don't know... There shouldn't there's, be very many of those. There's not any coming up that I can see on uh, Sky for Sim. So. Oh, uh, let me pass on this trick that uh, we've learned. Sometimes uh, when you've stopped and stuff and you start again, the uh, the goose seems to be kind of like it's got its brakes on or doesn't respond just right. So right here to the right of the steering wheel is your parking brake in the Sim. Go ahead and click it on and click it off. 
and then your 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 braking and everything should return back to normal. Things will be better. I have to do that. Too. Also, if you have any other windows in your 3D space, like for me, I've got my my map open. If I've accidentally left the mouse with the mouse pointer over the map, then the map has control, and you no longer have throttle or brake control. You can steer, mm. but throttle will stop working. So, so your first thing you should check is just to make sure that you don't have some, you know, move your mouse back off of whatever it is you last touched. Oh my God, that makes sense. Look at this. And I like to. Wow. Look at that. Yeah. Come on. There's a subtle, subtle little uh, view there to the right. Man. Jeez. As we travel an actual road. <laughs> Still mind boggling to me. And then, if I remember <clears throat> this road well enough, there's a. Uh, Something coming up just just past where Skin Flints is now. A little uh, pull out with some. Um... There's an A20 flying down in the valley. Oh yeah, Jeez. <laughs> below us. <laughs> That's yeah. great. There are a few picnic areas. <laughs> Bye, Skin. <laughs> See oh, ya. No. <laughs> oh, he go over the edge. Uh, he grabs some air. And, uh, 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 <laughs> I oh, don't sorry. think he really paid much attention to the landing zone. <laughs> Again, we'll sit up here at the top. We'll wait for you. Yeah, sure we will. <laughs> I mean, um, <laughs> no. but I'm going to throw you a line, Skin. He's back. <laughs> oh, pardon me. Excuse me. Pardon me. Oh, oh, pardon me. It's just me. Oh, <laughs> that was nice. He came flying over the top of me. <laughs> well, see, now this is one of those places. So if you look at this area right here, we're kind of at the top of a, a pass. And right over here is a little place where people have pulled over and started campfires and had picnics and set up tents. And Oh, what a place. And got we... next, gotten a lot of air like... Uh, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm trying to look and see what's oh, out there. Oh, it's a big field. That's a good, that's a good one. Wow. Let me get in the drone camera here. Parking brake set. Yeah, see, now this right. might be a little a little place to get some shots. Oh my gosh. Oh, there's a car here. In the in the satellite photography, there's a car. Oh. Oh yeah. Wow. Wow. It's amazing. Are okay. you sure it's not a Lexus? It's more than likely a truck or a Jeep. Yeah, <laughs> probably so. Let me uh, get up there. What, you were thinking oh. it was an expensive car? <laughs> oh, yeah. Somebody, somebody drove their, you know, Mercedes yeah. up there. Yeah, sure. Sure they did. You see a broken down RV up here. Don't stop to ask how they're doing. <laughs> All right. Are we moving or what are we doing? Yeah, we're heading out. Yep. Okay. A320 is pretty close. Where is he? There you guys are. This is pretty cool. <laughs> In the spirit of adventure. Yeet.
Mm. Just imagine how good your brakes would have to be to do this in real life. Oh right? my god. Use, use the gears to control your speed as you're going down. Yep. I discovered, you know, that's, you know, I learned that I had to do that on the farm, but then I got a really, a, a car that got really great gas mileage, and there are two things that it does not do well. One of them is back pressure, because <laughs> yep. the, the entire engine is only a 1.8 liter, so it's got about as much back pressure as, <laughs> as a fart. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. And uh, the other thing is that since it burns so little fuel in the wintertime, when you're waiting for the heater to uh, warm up the car, uh -oh. eh, you're going to wait for a while. Wrong turn. There's a little cabin up here. Okay, well, I don't know where you are, but... Uh, oh, there you go. Yeah, there you go. Yes. Left-hand turn, tight left. Okay. Was I in front? You were. Yes, you were. Oh, wow. I you didn't were, realize it. You were leading. I was trying to catch up to you guys. Well, how'd that work out for you? That, Pretty good. That explains why it was a little harder to catch you. Yeah. <laughs> all right. Hopefully we're all grouped up. If not, say just say something. I see think, SDW uh, is checking in. Hey, SDW, congratulations. Congratulations. Yeah, congratulations, cool. SDW. Let's wait up here by the red barn. Okay. This will this will end up being some famous um, mining or something. Got a hell of a view off the edge here, though. Right. Wow. Parking brake is set. The well, I gotta see if I can fix my. Uh... Yeah, I'll be right back, guys. Okay. Yep. Can we take a little short break here? <laughs> I did. Yes, I we can. So. Yes, we can. I'll catch up with chat. And yes, STW, I was <laughs> immersed. I was too immersed to look at chat. You're absolutely right. Uh, yeah, congratulations, though. Um, Dylan mentioned uh, that you passed your exam today. And so I just want to say, you know, uh, congrats and, uh, you know, well earned. Uh, nice job there, STW. Nice. So, for those that don't know, STW222 is a VATSIM ATC controller, air traffic controller. And, uh, you know, you progress through different levels of air traffic control. Uh, ground, tower, approach, departure, um, uh, center. And, you know, STW has been, you know studying and uh, making his way through and he just uh, passed his exam I think for approach I believe it was an approach exam so you can uh, do approaches on your own that's awesome uh, let's see Sleva says came in to go to sleep to you guys got to be up in five hours welcome in Sleeveless. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you guys I'm are so sure boring. I'm gonna I was going to say, I'm not sure. Is that a compliment? Uh... <laughs> Don't think so. But, uh, <laughs> nice of you to stop by anyway, Sleeveless, and, you know, appreciate your honesty. We can take it. We're come durable. In to, come in to go to sleep. <laughs> 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 we'll lull you right to sleep, you bet. Yeah, that's funny. Nice. Yeah, we're up there. Locks ASMR, that's right. We have always <laughs> been called worse. <laughs> Welcome to the Flux ASMR. <laughs> we ASMR all the time, all the day. I don't know. I don't know how that's just, ASMR. That's just really creepy, man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, Fox, you went right over right over weird and got into creepy. So uh, I don't know. <laughs> it probably wasn't the result you were looking for. <laughs> oh, man. Uh, it's an honor. He means it as an honor. It's an honor. He says, you guys are sure doing a, ter a, ter a, ter a terrible job <laughs> of, of, of putting him to sleep. All right, putting you to oh, sleep. Oh, okay. Terrible job of putting you to sleep. He's going to go back to reading the DC six manual. <laughs> oh, <God. laughs> well, at least we're getting uh, we're getting replaced by something that's actually going to work. Oh, that's funny. Yeah, 
All right. So, Misha, we're going to stay on the County Road 14, or we're going to go to, what's this other one, U.S. Basin, Brooklyn's? Uh, I'm going to zoom in a little bit so that I can see some words. So, straight south is the uh, the County Road 14 if you go east. It looks like it goes over and it turns and comes back down. They join up together anyway, south of us. So, I guess it really doesn't matter. I am not seeing um, that, but yeah, the real road is actually to our left, and we go down, and we do a little river crossing, and then come back, and that's on my map, it's showing that it's County Road 14 all the way. Okay. Then we'll drop down into U.S. Highway 50, and we'll, then we'll drive south about, ooh, I don't have a mileage meter here, but um, probably three miles on Highway 50, and then we turn right. And we'll go on to the Ophir Pass Road, and I don't know how much time we have. So are we, uh, are we ready to roll there, Flox? Yeah, let me, uh, just uh, in celebration of STW getting his uh, oh, jam yeah. passed, I'm going to give him a shout-out. He's And he says he's debating between Indy, Indianapolis, and Columbus Approach tomorrow. He says he knows hmm. a guy whose home turf is the KCMH area. I asked him if he'll be around tomorrow. If he's not, he'll control Indy. So let me give a quick little shout-out here. Uh, yeah, big congrats, STW. That's awesome. Uh, is this all craft this frequency? No, no, no I'm just backing up. Uh, We're still going to follow you. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah, so we, all, we all head to back up, too. <laughs> Me, she can go backwards. We'll still follow you. <laughs> wow. There's, yeah. there's blind and faith or something. If you go up. If yeah. you jump off a bridge, we'll probably follow you, follow you there, too. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, you know, since stupidity doesn't really have any teeth in the sim, I'm pretty sure it's a, it's not any grand thing to say, we'll follow you. Whatever. Skin, skin is not a, not a lemming, man. He's not a follower. He just, uh, <laughs> <laughs> he just jumps out there. It's like, yep. I'm yeah, the skid foot. I think just he's having he's having a little trouble with us because I think we're going too slow. We we stop for a break. We look out over the edge, and he's going. <laughs> well, you know, give me that air time. Maybe, maybe we've got twenty years on 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 skin, and we need more breaks than he does. I don't know. Yeah, yeah. No. Look, he's look, the Leroy, Miss the Leroy Daisy. Jenkins of uh, yeah. a flight sim. <laughs> when a man says he's got to make water, a man's got to yeah. make water. Oof. Well, that wasn't quite oh, what I wanted to do. Here was a pretty little place. Couple of lakes. And a very smooth road for about 20 feet. Oh, that's a little, that's a sweet little spot right here, isn't it? And then back to bumpier and I'll get out. Bumpier than a teenager's face. Yeah. <laughs> Whoa! Sorry. I was a, I was a real teenager. Woohoo! Actually, this really does look like a decompressed granite rock road. Man, this is very realistic. Oh, this is this is cool right in here. This little shadow and this turn. Yeah. Oh, that's cool. <laughs> oh, that's nice. That's that that was sweet right there. I think I'm going to have to buy a new set of shocks when we get to the bottom. Yeah. <laughs> huh? I'll look at chat here in a second. The drop off right on my right. Yeah, when you're open meadows, it's not so bad, but... <laughs> but boy, you're on the edge of a mountain. I'm I'm just I'm kind of like Fox. I'm still really surprised that this road is actually flat the way it is, and not just yeah, you yeah. know, Part a white line on the side of a mountain. Yeah, exactly. No, something we've been noticing when you get into uh, places that have got this one meter resolution or whatever, then then these little trails will be flat. But when it's uh, four and six and eight, whatever that other oh, low res, that's why you can go to Mexico or. Where else did we go that was just so flat? It was just uncanny. Yeah, we Porto, did do Porto, something. Porto, yeah, you and I went to... Porto. 
I can't remember. Chunky and I were out racing around in some other country, and it was just smooth and flat everywhere. It was it Puerto it was Rico? Because was it? nope. My oh Peru. Peru. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, we went to Peru, then we went to Mexico, and we found that the resolution was so uh, coarse that everything was just flat and smooth and could do 110 miles an hour on any dirt road. So all we need now is a special tool in the sim that will allow me to smooth out this road a little bit without changing the grade of it, and currently they have no such tool. And, um, that was the same day we were uh, trying to figure out how to drop down into the Grand Canyon without dying, wasn't it? <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> yep, dumb ideas don't stop here. They just sort of pick up speed. <laughs> oh, man. If we don't stay on these switchbacks, we're going to pick up speed. <laughs> yeah. These switchbacks are here for a reason, because gravity sucks. <laughs> We're getting a little a little far ahead here, Misha. I don't know if you Okay. Wanna... Yep, I'll slow down a little. I just passed up somebody. Somebody's stuck back there a ways. Uh, that's me. I'm I'm coming. I'm trying to catch oh, you okay. guys. I went <laughs> off the bank and Oh, you went off the bank. And then you tried to hide it by not telling anybody. That was Oh well, the... yeah. No, now I'm let us you should let us enjoy that with you. I mean, uh, no. make fun of no. What? What am I trying to say? Uh, you're saying full <laughs> disclosure. <laughs> full disclosure is a redemption of all evils. Ooh. Something like that. I wasn't going to go to all evils, but you know, <laughs> you want to toss a few more things into the bucket. Uh, I'm okay with that. All, all idiot rooms. There, there we go. <laughs> oh darn it. All right, come here. Does this thing have, like, dynamic dirt on it? Because Fox pulled up next to me, and uh, he's got dirt all over the side of his. So yeah, isn't there just crap everywhere now? I've uh, got dirt on mine, too. So we, that'll uh, be we hit great water. in the next yeah. iteration. If we hit water, Oops. we'll see if we get cleaned up here. Yeah. Are we, uh, oh, are we grouped up? Nope, uh, tree is still one, two, three, four. Yeah, we're, we're, we're creeping down at like, you know, 10 miles per hour or something like that. He's got about uh, five really tight corners to make yet. Yeah, let's see. <clears throat> Unless you just want to aim it straight down the hill and punch it. Yeah, I see you guys. <laughs> hey, Balin TV. Welcome and thank you for the follow. Welcome to Flockstrot's hangar. We'll be sure to leave the hangar doors cracked open for you. Ooh! Nice. That was not the right... Oh, yeah. Uh, watch out for that one, uh, <laughs> Fox. <laughs> a nice uh, there's a train a... spake co coming? Yeah, there's a, it's a fake out. You, you think it, the road's going to go one way, and it doesn't. Yeah, and, and you can't... Oh, yeah, you you think way. it's a little wider than it actually is. And there's a ditch on the other side. Yeah, if I didn't see you there, I would have followed it. And hey, if Lee. you say it, if you yell ditch, we'll know what you're talking about. Yeah. But if you slur your words at all, we're going to think you said something else. Yeah. Which? <laughs> Which? <laughs> Glitch? Which <one? laughs> Twitch? Go out there and grab me a switch so that I can beat you in the... All right, we're grouping up down here. Grouping up by Highway 550. Here comes Tree. Oh, yeah, I think there's some dynamic dirt here because there's some mud splatters on this green one. <laughs> Help! Thanks. <laughs> Help. <laughs> Thanks for showing us what not to do. Well, hey there, tree. How'd you make it hey. down so quick? Well, uh, through the trees. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> okay. Heading yeah. south now. Okay. Mostly south. Wow, doesn't this feel like oh! a super highway? Oh, man. 
Uh, I think I I think I went vert. I didn't go south. I went vertical. Yeah, I don't, I don't know what you hit, but that was impressive. Did you at least stick the landing? Because you can't get into the Olympics unless you can stick the landing. I think I did. Well, I, I did. Uh, I did. Yeah. I didn't. Uh, I didn't have to wait for it to flip back over. Yes, I think I did. Okay. Don't go too far. You're going to miss the turn. Oh, skin flints. Yeah, it's all right. We call him back about every five minutes anyway. <laughs> skin. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, a little oh, train man. failure there <clears throat> and a right turn is happening right now do, 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 do. oh man oh man <laughs> oh, oh this is not the right, smoothest road right here <laughs> okay who did we lose we still got one behind us somewhere looks huh? like uh, possibly treetop I was say, not right. me, I'm here. Right turn, Clyde. In about uh, 20 yards there, Tree. I'll back up where you can see me on the road. There he is. Nice. See, another really wide gravel road. It's still bumpy, <laughs> like no one knows how to even rent a road grader, but but it's a road. I ain't going across that bridge again. I tried that once. She'd grab me and wouldn't let me go. I will be right back, guys. You guys can go on. I'll catch up to you. Watch that. <laughs> oh, got a floor on the bridge. And hit the juice. <laughs> that ah, big, I, I don't it. know that helps on that one. I made did it. You? I made it. Oh, that's cool. I was sideways and and whatnot, <laughs> but I got across. Uh, I did not make it. My my first trip across that bridge was a that bridge grabbed a hold of me, wouldn't let go, and then just laughed at me. Oh, you think you can get out now? Oh, that's that's funny. That's hilarious, actually. Okay, so we're on Ophir Trail now? We are on Ophir Pass Road. Oh, this is and I'm not crazy. entirely sure, but I think this might be the only way into Ophir, Colorado. Oh, really? So, yeah. Even to this day, I would have to check, see if there's another way out. But this is the uh, epitome of, of uh, secluded off the grid kind of stuff. Well, it'd be cool if you're the FedEx and UPS driver and you get to drive a, you know, a four, four by four. <laughs> well, this isn't, it's an actual passable road, I think. It's not quite like um, Black Bear Pass. Oh. But just like all the other ones, now there should be a fork coming up, and we take the right, the right fork if we actually see both of them. But I doubt it. Oh, 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 oh catching an edge. <laughs> mm, got somebody right on my tail, but then I don't see anybody else. So I, I, I think I see you guys up there, just a little bit ahead. Okay, we're still good. So, uh, well, I don't know, because I'm not sure. If there's people behind me. Yeah, I'm, I'm coming up on somebody now. I'm going to pull up on this uh, side of this road here. There's three of us. And it looks like four and five are both moving back there. So we got Chunky. Chunky, are you back with us? Yep. Cool. Never yeah, really caught left. up with you real quick. You're not... Uh, Tree, are you are you on the road? Or are you down in the river? So so just look across this canyon to our left. You can see a couple of gold mines into the side of the mountain over there. Oh yeah. Here, let me see. Show those, are, those are dashed dreams of someone planning on making it big. So there's one right here. And the other one's just up the up the canyon a little bit.
There's tree. Coming through the trees. <laughs> he's, oh. he's, you know, if you, if you can't find him, he's out communing with squirrels or something, well, you know. You're a drug runner, you know, you just, you're used to the trees, man. <laughs> That's what we do. Yeah, right. We don't you stick see? to the main roads. You know? No, 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 no. And, and I'm sure I scared you with my story, you know, because I said that this used to you know, at least at one time was the only way in and out of Ophir. So that would be, you'd think, oh, yeah. you're thinking that's the main road. Obviously, right. the Popo is going to be guarding this road. So, yeah, you are you were wise to uh, take a, yeah. a shortcut. Yeah, we'll I'll go through the trees. Just doing Get to know nature. Little scenery uh, shot here with the, uh, the drone camera catching you guys down there. Uh-oh. <laughs> So what you're saying is we're gonna have to wait for you to catch up. <laughs> no, I'll, 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 I'll put I'll put the juice on the goose and catch up to you. <laughs> yeah, right. Like like these tight oh, turns man. will support juicing it. <laughs> you don't want to go too fast in these things. But uh, that is a nice view watching you guys. Pretty cool. Yeah, that's like I was uh, flying the helicopter for you guys that one night and uh, kind of leading you through the trails and stuff. Yes. Yes. Uh, that was fun because just flying from the helicopter, looking down, watching you guys drive through it was cool. Yeah, whole different perspective. Yeah. Whew. Yeah, this one's this is a pretty narrow road in in real life. I can tell. Do a little catch up here if I can. Uh, we're going about twelve miles per hour, so. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> the, the, whoa, the whoa, concentration. <laughs> yeah, right. What was that noise for, Tree? <laughs> that was a spin out noise. Okay. Right. I think I might have a flat tire or something. <laughs> oh. <laughs> I think an angry letter to Parallel 42 right now is in order. Yes. Uh, How I want, dare you make a little vehicle that gets a flat tire? Come on. I want radials, man. <laughs> I'm pretty sure these are radials. I want I want some serious XM in it, though. <laughs> Listen to some music while we're out here. I think there is a radio solution in the in the dash in the middle Ooh. between the seats. There's something I just, down there. I just noticed a trail going off to the left, so down in that valley to our left, and we'll be able to get a view of it here as we get up. There's got to be some camping because people are have been going down in there to do fishing or camping or something. Oh, yeah, what a beautiful little canyon. If I see your name tags around this bend here. Are you with me, Tree? Yep. Okay. Should we just stop somewhere, Mish? Here's a nice little field on the right. I don't think we're that far behind you. But yeah. I mean, it won't take that long for us to get there. Oh, this is sweet right here. Wow. Uh, and you can see now that there's a there's a mountain kind of to our uh, maybe eight o'clock nine o'clock with some gouges in it where the uh, you can tell where the um, snowpack finally gives way and the uh, the glaciers slide down and wipe out the trees because there's one two three four five six gullies or cuts down in that mountain face. Okay, so you know, it's pretty barren on top. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Let me pretty bald up there. Are looking at here, off to the left. Oh yeah, see that? So it's almost always just avalanches when the uh, when the glaciers up on top finally give way, and it does does mean that that uh, that's not so high that uh, that it's permafrost up there, so it does melt every summer and freeze up pretty good during the winter. Hold up, Mish Treetop is almost with us. Almost, okay. And uh, the other thing I'm noticing that down in that valley, yep. 
is a bunch of uh, bunch of logs. There's logs here on the hillside going down there too. Oh yeah, look yeah. at that. Yeah, they, they all. So, I wonder if they roll down here, you know, and they kind of collect. Well, down they here. would. Yeah, they would get uh, they would get broke off by the the snow falling or sliding down the hill, but then. Yeah, Each look, year, it would slide better. Then another avalanche would haul some more down. And, and here's some of the trees on their way down. You can see them on the hillside on the stream here. As I'm going up, oh, like yeah. these ones haven't made it down yet. Yeah. But one day they'll be down there. Interesting. One day. All right. So not not yeah. a very hospitable place to live, I would think. Can you imagine? You know, being woke up in the middle of the night to the sound of oh yeah, right. 300, 300 trees making their way down a hill. No, uh, no. <laughs> you don't even want to think about it, do you? <laughs> I don't know. Every time I'm, every time I'm in the mountains and I see a, a, a road like this, realizing that it used to be just a, you know, a mule trail. And then got widened so that uh, you could pull a wagon over, and then got widened again so that you could drive a car or a jeep or a something. And those people just had a hard life, right? Boy, and they right. they still claim complained less than we complain about all yep. the little you know. Yep. Yep. Because yeah, they didn't know any better. I wish this yeah. digital road could be smoother, for crying out loud. Right? <laughs> exactly. Yeah. yeah. Exactly. Uh, case in point. Yep. Yep. Or, or you look at a you look at a train failure, and oh, I got a sowboat again. But you know that we wouldn't be doing this without them. We wouldn't them. be doing this without it. Yep. 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 And uh, and, and we wouldn't have this road without all the pioneers who decided that out of all the rugged canyons to get from this area over to Ophir, this was the best one. Because, you know, just like Lewis and Clark would would uh, go out, what do they call it? Um, Bumbus Method, business. discover it, land on it? Oh, yeah. yeah, something like that. Uh, it's it's the kind of a, a deal where you check out five or six canyons and then compare survey. notes and go, yeah, they're doing a survey and See, so they decide this will be the easiest one to build a road on or to take your mule on or whatever it is they're doing. And then when they found gold and they didn't want to build really wide roads because you can tell a, a road takes leveling all the way, that's where narrow, narrow gauge railroads would come in. So now you're building railroads with a four foot three inch uh uh, width between the tracks instead of the usual whatever it is five and a half feet because uh oops okay i think we need to group Let's... up again here i only see yep. three of us misha is the, the, this road goes two different ways so what is this what we want to do good question yes this uh this is what we did last time what we're doing right now okay yep yes yeah, there's two way back there still Oh dear, there are. I can see them through the through yeah. the ground. Yeah, there's this little thing here. Find a spot to wait. See them yep. there. Let's see. Sorry. Looks like it's right over here. Okay. I was in story time and and uh, <laughs> moving up through. Yeah, this is the real. This is the real road. The other thing is not much more than a cow path, according to sources that shall remain nameless. Oh. I really like the drone view over the top of you guys. Checking you out. <laughs> oh, and here they are. are. Hop skin. He's waiting for him. I think he, are you towing him up, Skin? Yeah. <laughs> I think he went back to get me. What he did. Yeah. No thank man you, left behind. That's why we do it. Yes, thank you, Skin. Yeah, right about here you'd be thinking, I wonder when's the last time I checked the air in my spare tire. 
I'm kind of thinking, did I remember to bring oxygen with me? Yeah, we're getting up there, aren't we? <laughs> All right. Oh man, that's a nice view. I just can't get over just how how good that mountain kind of at my eleven o'clock looks right now because that's uh, wrong way, uh, Flox. Oh, yep, spin it around. I'm gonna make a hard left there at that hairpin there. <laughs> yep, we're going up this way. Uh, this way, guys. This way, tree. Where is it? Lost it. There it is. Somebody's still, <laughs> somebody's still going the wrong way. Uh, let's see, other way tree. Say it again so we can sample it correctly. Michael, uh, two people in front of me here. It's going to come down this ridge here. Skin, oh, skin I'm going the wrong way. The right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's right. Oh my god! Oh, we, need, we definitely need a sample of that one. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah. Can we do a su super sampling? <laughs> yes, we can. Oh man. <laughs> This way, tree. This way, tree. Oh, <laughs> I'm going the wrong way. <laughs> I have to put this by oh, myself. God, brilliant. Oh, man. Yeah. No, wait a minute. He was doing that on purpose. No. Nope. Sure he was. <laughs> and, uh, yeah. <laughs> Look, if... if uh, I was going to be lost. If you guys ever show up in Colorado and, and, uh, and he wants to lead a hike i mean we're all gonna yeah. die we definitely know who's not driving the jeep now <laughs> oh, <dang it>. oh <laughs> man <laughs> oh i'd be glad to let him pay for it i'm just not sure we should <laughs> let him drive it <laughs> agreed <laughs> although i don't know all right guys i'm with you maybe all right so funny yeah, good go. to have good to have everyone back again because we're we're getting up into the high country here I had one of those trees uh, slide down the hillside and hit my undercarriage and just kind of put me in a turn. So that, that's, that's okay. What that's what happened. That's what happened. Yeah. Really uh, nice look. It's very common up here. <clears throat> As he slips me a twenty for lying right through my teeth. <laughs> oh yeah, that's that's common. You know. Uh, Sleva says aviation news has been crazy lately. But I can't read it all because I gotta pay attention where I'm going. Uh, Air Canada Triple Seven had a really bad landing, and Cargo Seven Four had to do a turnaround because of a loose horse on board. Oh no! Wow, wow. that doesn't happen every day. No, no. Yeah, yeah. But that's one thing you don't want is any weight shifting of any kind, no matter what. Size the aircraft is. Wherever the weight oh. is, better be center of gravity, and it better stay there. Oh, <sighs> I'm jockeying for a position with treetop. I think. Well, you guys just uh, just get in there and have a good time. I'm enjoying the scenery and realizing I'm probably going to get my car down here and see if I can make this road in my car. I'll take lots of pictures. Oh, that's amazing. That would be great. It's practically a day's drive, though, on mountain roads just to get to this area. Man, how beautiful this would be, though. Would you stay, like, the night or something once you got up here? Yeah. 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 I would. Um, I would. I'd have a heater. I'd bring <laughs> whatever stuff you need. God, I'm watching these guys on YouTube with blow up tents and all these heaters and all this stuff. Well, you've There's... seen my one person camper. I that you know, works. I, I'm not gonna sit around, you know, especially when you're on a on a trail called Black Bear Pass. You don't you don't spend the night in a canvas tent, you know. No. No You've got a hard side tent. Um right. black bears know how to open up cars and they just sort of 
they get their fingernails into that door jam and they rip the doors off or they bounce off the glass until they break a window. Right, you've, you've seen, so bears have done that? Hold, hold yes. Up, hold up here oh, around wow. this little bend here. Hold up here. Oh, okay. well, we're not going to spend all day up here. No, no, we? no, we're not. We're not. We're not. But <laughs> just, just, a just a time or two, I want to see uh -huh. if anybody can make this thing. Okay. So I'll, I'll point it out. Uh, but first, let me catch up with chat. Um, uh, Paradox saying hey to Sleeveless. Crazy news, I agree. Anyone know how to yodel <laughs> while we're up here? Does anybody on voice know how to yodel? I I do, but I'm not going to do it on uh, on chat. <laughs> okay. <laughs> the then... only thing I can think of is the commercial Ricola. Ricola. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only thing I can I know how. I just am really terrible at it. But my oh, there mom you go. and everyone of her generation knew how to yodel. And uh, they tried to teach me, and I just sort of butchered it. So I know how. I know what I'm doing wrong. It's just like, uh, is this really something I want to spend even eight more seconds trying to do? <laughs> no, no, it's not. So uh, it, it, as you're watching Fox do this little stunt here, he's going to climb up this mountain to your right. Yep, yep. And, and then uh, uh, here we go. So uh, 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 with the eye, I wants to know what game is this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and forty five seconds to the or forty five points for the first person that can tell us what game. What game is, is this? Because <laughs> right. that's the real question, well, isn't it? And right. and, well, and and with the eye, I, I just got to say, we're all wannabe pilots, and we've had thousands of hours in flight sim, but somehow we've found these uh, gooses here, and uh, so we're rediscovering what we've flown over for thousands of hours. I guess that'd be the best way to put it. Yeah. Are we going up you that hill? No, 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 no. Let me let me get lined up here. I gotta find I gotta find my little spot that I was. Oh, you don't you don't through. really need to start in a specific spot because you're still not gonna make it. <laughs> All right, so it's right here. It's right here. Okay, and you, so t take a look at the stream. Whoops! 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 Yeah, God dang it! Okay, take a look at the stream. Now, right in front of me is this Devil's Tower looking like thing right here. I don't know if you guys can see that or not. I tried for like, we must have been here for 30 minutes. <laughs> and while we we're t chatting and stuff just, like that, I was just going up and down this damn thing, yep. trying just to go get over it. the top of it. Okay. Just go up it. So here we it, go. It's That's the best way to, to prove. Oops. Hitting the juice. Say, Chunky, it's not making it to the top. It's going up the face that he's going up. Right there. Oh, 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 oh. No, 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 no. Can't go up. Yeah, he's trying he's to go up the he's devil's up. tower face. Yeah, this, the one this behind thing, you. This thing right here, I'll stay here until you get, until you see it. I'll, I'm right at the base of it. I, I got you. I okay. got you. All right. But see, the, the problem is when you, when you uh, go up the first couple of feet of that, you compress all four of your suspension springs, and it pushes you away from the rock, and you lose... You lose your traction. All right, and so I'm going to set up my drone camera on the side. And I would love <laughs> to see everybody give this thing a shot, and then we'll head on. Parking brakes on. <laughs> drone camera. I'm going to get my drone camera right at the top of that dang thing. Ooh, so close. <laughs> I know. I've been there. I've been there. All right, so here's the drone camera at the top of this thing. Yeah, he has been there. And good luck to anybody that is uh, foolish enough to try this. Now, I did not. Cr I've never tried crawling. Maybe you need to crawl. Maybe you use the need to crawl function. Here comes Chunky. He's ripping it. Don't forget about the juice goose button. You can juice it. Yep. Yeah, yeah, I'm getting all crooked though. He's trying to. All right. Let me. Uh, let me go back down. Huh? How did I get here? <laughs> you, you cheated. That's how. So 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 he was asking what you know what 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 game is this? <laughs> and Skinflint says it's the Flox Trot I'm Lost Simulator. 
<laughs> that's well i don't that's not your line i mean it's sort of treetops line <laughs> is treetops Ooh, supposed to go, say go, uh am i going the wrong way <laughs> that is that's about as close as we've ever seen right there although uh flocks when you made it up that far you sort of dangled on the edge and my tires went over the edge and hung up on the top a little bit yep oh yeah okay here comes Mish. <laughs> I love the horn. <laughs> You're the only one. <laughs> I am the only one. Okay, Mish is doing the crawl. He's trying to crawl. Ooh, ooh, he's advancing. It's just about dang vertical, isn't it? Okay, I need more. Nope, I don't need three. more. I need less. Tree's making a run. Tree's looking good. Tree's on the line. Hitting it, hitting it. Up, 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 up. Oh, man. That's junky. He's in the teal. There's Tree. Oh, here's Tree. Here's Tree. Sorry. Are your tires spinning at the bottom, guys? Just Yeah, yeah Skin just Flint. trying Skin to. Skinflint's has got to run. Come on, skin, you got it, bud. Come on, hit it, hit it, hit it. Oh. That's impossible. That's right. Now, in the early days, there was a gentleman by the name of Zebulon Pike who looked at Pike's Peak, actually, before it had a name, and he said, that's an unclimbable mountain, which is why they named it after him. Oops. After they got to the top? Yeah. <laughs> First guy to get to the top went, Zebulon doesn't know what he's talking about. All right, let's hit the trail, boys. Yeah, time to hit the trail. One, one, more, one more shot. One more right. shot. One right. more shot. Here comes skin. So here it goes. You know, I, I'm I'm noticing just a slight uh, slight repeat of some of the. Uh... <laughs> oh, oh yeah, there's a terrain thing. It, yeah, your wheels actually drop in. The wheels actually drop in on it. Y yeah. So when you get over the top, it it does cause a problem. All right, the skin flint's going for it. Wait a minute, wait a minute. Let's see, where are you guys? Let's see. Influence making a run. Oh, not quite. Let's see. Tree, what are you doing up there? I I made it. <laughs> what are you talking about? Uh, I've been yeah. up I've been up here for five minutes waiting for you guys. There we go. Yeah. Not sure. Maybe, I don't know, maybe you got distracted on the way up or something. I don't know, but I'm up here. Let's see. If I could just find you, I'd really have bragging rights. I'll tell you, I'll tell you when you're in the right direction. Hang on. Uh, when, when instead of sliding off the backside, wherever... Okay, you want see. No, I know. I know where you are. I know okay, you are. Okay, okay. Right, right there. Right, right there. There we go. We'll, we'll, right uh, there. I might. I might have you. Let's see. Maybe. Maybe. This could be a total bust. But I knew where I was the whole time. Yep. <laughs> yep. Oh my God. No, I didn't know where I was. Come oh, back to. The, come back to his tree. Walk towards the light. Oh, I thought it was at the top of the rock. Yeah, right up here. This where we're trying to get. Uh, you to your left a little bit. Yep, but. Uh... Oh shoot! No, <laughs> too late. Too late. I'm going down. <laughs> Still falling. Well, I'm Still just falling. gonna. I'm just gonna tell you, I was up there. Yeah, I yeah. saw I saw the light. And <laughs> you guys did still. 
All right. All right, I'm ready. Oh, somebody's already gone. Are we all together? Or are we all getting on the trail? Uh huh. I'm behind what I think is Flox. Yep, I think, yeah. I was just taking a look. Okay, there's Skin. There's Mish. A little catch up here. Oh, that view. Come on, guys. There's a little grass on the left side, and I can hear the grass in the sim. Oh, no, no, no. I'm going down the hill now. Whee! <laughs> oh, there you are down there. I got a little sideways on the road, and, uh, yep. Well, recovering from a mild crash. I'll be back in a jiff. Don't wait it's for me. <laughs> Don't mourn my passing. Where you go, I go. Oh, I almost didn't see that switchback. Wow. Ooh, 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 ooh. Come on, come on, come on. Come on, come wow. on. Wow. Oh, now I'm going to be down here where uh, Chunky is. Nice. And Did you... Guys, hit the trail again? Yeah, we're uh, yeah, on the trail. Hi. How you doing, Tree? Good, good. Oh, this view, come on. Can switch back? Yeah. The views are good. Oh, I hit missed the switch back. Jeez. All right, wait. There's a lake down there. Oops, wait, hang on. Right. That's what I did earlier, but I went all the way down the hill. <laughs> yeah, well, I did what you did. It is, uh, it is an impressive road oh, in the summer. Uh, the lake down yeah. there is really pretty. It's just gorgeous. In the winter, it's not impressive. It's just scary. We should... Set it to winter time and let's see what we get. Uh, you get even less traction than what you got now. Yeah. <laughs> let's see. Well, I took a shortcut. And you guys are headed. Oh, there you are. Never mind. Oops. Wow. I just can't wrap my head around that the edge of this road is in the mountainside in the sim. <laughs> I know. It just, it just boggles my mind that that's amazing level of details here. Oh, looking good, you guys. Looks amazing. Oh, here we go. Oh, no! no! Don't roll here. Don't roll here. Don't roll here. <laughs> oh, you saved it. <laughs> oh. <laughs> Years oh. of mountain driving have saved my <clears throat> bacon right there. Be be careful coming up here. The road is not as flat. It's kind of angled now. Just so you know. That must be... We're getting into... Low resolution for the city of Ophir. Oh, oh no, we just, just have a weird a... bank. Yeah. And the uh, terrain failures on it don't help. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on. My drifting practice. Oh, yeah, it's going to be tricky. Oh, come on. And the trail kind of disappears here through the trees, so. Ooh, that was a spike. 
No, it seems a little bit early to start this because we're still a few miles away from Ophir. I thought we were almost there, but no. We got quite a bit of elevation to drop yet. I think there's, the trees are that thick that it's really blocking what they could get, you know? Yeah, yeah, that's it's a very likely scenario. Yeah, I can see a little nap map that the, the road is where we're going right now. Yeah, the satellite imagery was not good enough for it. Any trees here? That's all right. Get a little damn map to carry us through. That's right. Well, you can even follow the road pretty well on the little screen right in, right on your oh, little yeah. Juice yeah. Boost dash. Yeah, that too. So for those of you without all that high-tech wizardry. All right, let's make sure we're grouped up here now that we're getting into a little something that we can drive on. Yeah, that's what I was kind of waiting for people to catch up. Yeah, well, I'm catching up. Okay, I think maybe the next clearing down the hill might be the one to group up on, but... Okay. The, uh, do that. That one. You still got some pretty nasty trees right after the that spot right. where you pulled up. Okay. Do you have a little we'll map just... up or something? Can you see the trail tree? Yeah, I got it. Okay, good. This, uh, yeah, but I got a nav map, but um, it's better to just look on a dash of the juice here. Okay. I can see where everybody is. and. Okay. Yeah, it's pretty pretty yeah, handy, it, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it is. Right? Although, I mean, right now I'm going through the trees, but besides that... I wish you could zoom out on that a little bit sometimes. Yeah. Well, I guess you're not supposed to ever be further away from your buddies than what fits on this map. That's a good rule of thumb. Unless one of them's rolling down a hill for miles. Or is running a rally course and jumps off the side of a cliff, you know, by accident. <laughs> somebody, <laughs> somebody took up off ahead of us there. Yep, and Tree followed him. All right, here we go. We all, two we guys together? out of sight. Yeah, yeah, we're all together. Yeah. So. A flock's here in third, I think. Uh, skin flints and, and tree are ahead of you. Not for long. Yeah. Tree, <laughs> you're in second. Do you know what? You know, I just wanted well, you to... there's a turn coming. There's a turn coming, guys. Ooh, I'm off the road. Where? Uh, we just <laughs> passed it. <laughs> yep. We got to go up this hill. No. Oh, you want... No, we're staying on this main trail, nope. right? Yep, stay in the main... Oh, why did the last time we went up that hill and that took us back up to, uh, that took us back up to Telluride? Oh, we're not to Ophir, Ophir yet, I see. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't go to Ophir last time. We turned right, right here right. and headed back up to Telluride. All right, I'm with you. Yep. <laughs> there were some other shenanigans last time because I think we had enough of the trees. The vegetation was starting to take its toll. Well, I'll get back to the trail. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I saw oh. a little flash of, of teal. That must have been. <laughs> that was me. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I... Oh! <sighs> Terrain failure. All right, so this is a big um, junction of many different roads. Or okay. Trail. Then I think we still the want one... to go forward, though, huh? Yep, just right along this, whatever that looks like in this sim. Yeah, I'm actually on the trail yet, but... I think I'm behind you guys. Can't see it. I'm just going through trees, mainly. Yeah, it's a little bit on the thick side here. Yeah, you just kind of, you see the white stuff on the in the grass and just Every following so that. Yeah. Just, uh, Oof. Well, that was a hell of a terrain failure. Oh, wow. I think I just found it. <laughs> All of a sudden, I was like 100 feet in the air. No! <laughs> okay. 
All right. So then we roll back up this direction. No, 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 that's up the hill. I think I'm going to have to go down the hill. Boy, I hope I... Uh, I'm, I'm you back know, on you the know trail. You know that old saying that uh, Treetop was teaching us about, you know, when you're by yourself? Oh, yeah. that terrain spike. I was above the trees. Yeah. Um, I've been by myself for a while. I hope I'm... All right. So, right I'm I'm on the edge of town, and I'm going to yep. try to stay here until I'm people right here can with see you. me. Oh, there's oh, a third another person. another one. Another one. Okay. But these terrain spikes are just crazy. <laughs> yes. Yeah, they are. I'm, I'm looking back up that canyon and I oh see a part of the road caught on the side. This is uh, spiking with Phloxtrot. Yeah. <laughs> so I think if you keep going downhill, but maybe stay on the right side of it, so if it feels like you're Oh man, you can't tell what angle you're balanced. You where you're baking when you're in the cockpit. You got to get third person, I suppose. Oh, there's the two stragglers. They're all here. We are all together. <laughs> did we show up at the yeah. same time? Yep, <laughs> yeah, you yeah. guys did. Hey, tree. Oh man, that was a hey, trick. Fox. <laughs> all right, here we go. Well, th this is the little town of uh, Ophir. Well, that's we're on the far. Oh, the yeah, edge. Wait, here, here's Main Street. To the left. Wow, every room has a view here. Oh yeah. Boy. And seclusion for days. Oh my gosh. Yeah. You think? Uh... I wonder if there's still like gold mining or anything going on here that's keeping people. Oh. Out here. Yeah, I would think so. Even the uh, the big famous uh, gold mine up in Cripple Creek is still active. It's been sold a couple times since I moved out here, but um, so we are essentially right downtown Ophir, and this is as big as the town gets. Wow, is that impressive? Very. Oh, so the little town I was in just a second ago, it was like an outskirts town, and now this yep. is the main town here. Yeah, that would be suburbs out there. <laughs> we uh, we passed by the five houses that make up the burbs. And now we're getting on County Road 630, and I don't really know where to go from here, guys. We're, uh, we are in uncharted territory. Wow. Although I think this it? road... Oh. 1039 getting... by Colorado time. Yeah, wow. it's almost... Uh... Almost ten o'clock here, so. I think I'm, I I'm, 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 I'm a little bit out of gas here. I'll grab some dinner, which I had part of earlier, but uh, this has been fun, like killer fun. Well, there's a little looks like a parking structure over here. Let's see if we can't uh, get our uh, gooses parked here at Ophir. Okay. Let's take a, a parting screenshot, and we'll call it a stream. Oh well, yeah. Don't quit on my account, though. If everybody wants to keep going, but let's get a picture. Yeah, absolutely. So I'm looking, Flox. Yeah, because what I'm looking at when I'm looking at the map here, here I'll pull it up so you guys can see it. Um, we we're, we're about halfway back to Telluride, so we've done like a big circle, and it's not quite halfway. Um, but if we ever wanted to leave Ophir and head back to Telluride. It's kind of a main road that goes up there, but there might be some back roads that we could take. But uh, yeah, that's that's to get back to where we started is quite the trip. So I think this is as good as a starting stopping point as any. Yeah. Good. Yeah. And we just try <clears throat> try to make it without going through the thick trees. Yeah. That would be the challenge. And I can see that right up here, to, treetop at your 10 o'clock, you see that canyon going up the side of that mountain without any trees on it? 
I do. It's not not much of a canyon, but that's a bare spot. Really? If we wow. Start start up that canyon or that draw, and then uh, see if we can make it up to the top, and then get our look around and get our bearings. That would be very cool. Okay, all right, I'm I'm up for that. You're you're up for that. I figured. <laughs> <laughs> I've had so much fun tonight, you guys. This is just been... yeah. It feels a little like we've actually done a little sightseeing. And that's yeah, a... I, I agree. That is just so uh, fabulous. That's where you want to get your picture over there by that little. Uh... Yeah, I was. Uh, I thought we could park underneath it, but nope. But it's hit boxes. It's it's not tall enough. Yeah, there's a hit box there. Oh. All if right, you guys want to, if you guys want to line up like I like I did, just back up to it hang all on, in a hang row. Hang on. Oh, oh my dart! Really, I'm not I'm not smart enough to back up, but I should. Uh, I want to show off my uh, rear end to the to the stream anyway. I got a door <laughs> open. Apparently, <laughs> I forgot to close that thing. It's been flapping. No wonder that's been half my problem. Probably drag. Isn't that kind of like having your flaps down and not realizing it? Well, yeah. Oh, Man, Paradox is asking how long we're streaming tonight. Yeah, we're getting ready to wrap up. And he says that cup is a weeble. It wobbles, but it doesn't fall down. Yeah, that's, that's right. You yeah, my door, I, I, I think it did change. I opened that door just by happenstance, and I think that changed the dynamic of how this darn thing worked because I kept uh, I couldn't keep up with you guys after that. Hey, hey, Tree, our top yeah. speed I think was seventeen for the day, so um, I'm not quite sure you're. Uh... <laughs> yeah, well, maybe not. Maybe it's yeah. just my skill set, but <laughs> I just throw no, that out I, there. I, I really I, I like the uh, I like the delivery. I yeah. like the thoughts you put into that. Yeah, but, not the uh, content. <laughs> it's just having trouble, you know, uh, believing. No, that, uh, you guys didn't miles have your, an hour. Yeah, you guys didn't have your door open. I did. Yeah. Yeah. There's a lot well, of. Yeah, you know, I was hitting trees and trunks and rocks and. Yeah. Hey, uh, <laughs> I, I just squirrels. found the artificial horizon in this thing. Oh, you? oh, you did? Yeah. So, um, on the main dash, you know, the main screen, there's a little, the little eye, the lowercase eye. If you click it, it shows you. Um, it's got like an artificial horizon right in the center and it'll show you pitch and roll. Oh, nice. So you can see when you're on an incline. Oh yeah. Oh, very cool. Nice. Yeah. I showed that one to Flox. I think it was yesterday, but it didn't really, doesn't really show much as far as pitch. It shows side to side, left to right roll, but it, it shows you your pitch just by the um, where the brown and blue line is compared to where the horizontal line is there in the That's center. That's what I thought too, but we were yeah. aimed up a hill at forty five degree angle, and it looked just like this. So it wasn't changing the vertical much; it was changing the left and right only. Because we were at a whatever it was like a forty five degree angle when we first discovered. Maybe, this. maybe it only goes so far. Yeah, that could, could be. be. You know, but it was a little less than uh, what we were looking for, so. Yeah, because mine right now is showing that, even though I'm level, it's showing 10 degrees. Oh, what a fun time, you guys. Yeah, it was a blast. Whew. Oh, my gosh. Just a, yeah, just a blast. Too much. Too much. D DH has got just. something for us in, D in general chat here. Let me take a look. <laughs> yeah, this is great. Weebles from Romper Room. Yep, yeah. Yep. Let me uh, let me get this <clears> in <throat> here. Uh, let's see. We'll play this real quick here. Uh, let's see. Where is my right play? <laughs> there we go. And then we'll bring that up. Did you get your pictures, Flox? I I did. Okay. Ever watch kids play with go. weebles? It's really something. Hey, hey, I had that airplane as a kid. <laughs> I think I did too. Oh, perfect. One day, kids pretend they're flying into Weeble Airport. I had to farm too with all the horses and everything. Yes. Or if it's real nice, they go out to the Weeble Marina and go fishing. Oh, I did not have the boat though. 
Wow, look at that. Romper Room. I remember that. That's great. <laughs> I, I do remember Romper Room. Well, I take it back, Chunky. I just crawled up the side of a building, and it showed me my uh, my pitch. Okay. So. Yeah, I think sure the I think your horizontal way. is is just uh if it's level or not, but the uh, the number I believe is the pitch. The only problem is you can't see the uh, the map when you have that up. So. <laughs> right. Yeah, you're missing missing some important information. All right, guys, we're going to wrap it up. Uh, and Paradox says, there's Tree's boat in that romper room commercial. <laughs> <laughs> there we go. Yeah. There, no, I think that's way bigger. <laughs> yeah. All right, we'll look way for somebody to, to, to raid off to. Uh, uh, Mish, thanks for introducing us to, uh, uh, you know, Black Bear Path Road. Pass. Pass. <laughs> yeah, uh, road. Black. Uh, yeah, you're welcome. Because we got to do it in real life next. Oh, yes, that's we gonna do. be awesome. <laughs> I agree. Amazing. And uh, I'll see if I can't improve my driving skills so I can try to put my card in for being able to drive the Jeep between now and then. <laughs> what a great time, you guys! What a great time! Thank you, thank you, Mish, Flox. What perfect stream! Couldn't have had more fun. Yep, and uh, yeah, thanks for being on voice uh, tonight, Chunky. Um, yeah. Yep, yeah. and uh, Tree, thanks for, for being a great co-host and a uh, great in real life next door neighbor and good friend there. And Skin Flints, man, thanks for uh, uh, joining us and and hitting the hitting the the mountain pass with us. That was that was a lot of fun. It was a lot of fun. Thanks for being with us, Skin. And chat. As always, much appreciated. Uh, looking forward to tomorrow night. And it'll be um, uh, a VAT sim uh, tomorrow night. And STW is going to be doing approach someplace because he passed his exam. So uh, we'll see if we can't uh, get up in the pattern yeah. and on frequency there with STW uh, tomorrow night. And then, uh, was it Thursday night? Uh, we're going to be checking out Greninsky's Gable Field. We'll do a fly-in. I'm thinking about taking off from Catalina and then flying into Gable Field there in the Hollywood Hills. And uh, I'll be flying the GB. And there's a race course there that we can check out and uh, have a little fun there uh, at Gable Field. So that'll be coming up Thursday night. Uh, thanks yep. again, everybody. Have a great night. And fly and drive safe. Challenge <laughs> accepted. <laughs> Good night, everyone. Good night. Good night. Good night. Treetop, if you want to see what Sky for Sim does in here, I've got my uh, stream shared right now. Night, Skinflints. And yep, good night, DH. We'll see ya. Good night. <laughs>